last episode of the Chaos Campaign, the adventurers uh, found the wolf cave and uh, decided to head in where they came across the first wave of wolves um, and after being beaten up pretty badly decided that they'll take a rest here in the middle of a wolf den. Things go about as, uh, about as you would expect <clears throat> and they got attacked during their sleep uh, and decided, you know what, we should probably clear out this cave before trying to rest in it. So you carried on, uh, searched the next room after killing some more wolves, found some nifty items. Let's have a look at what you actually found. You found, yeah, a bunch of unrefined gold. Uh, and like tons of pickaxes as well as a few dwarven skeletons sat about the place uh, and the hidden storage that you found some lumps of gold in looked to have been man-made like carved out uh, so some of you started to piece together that perhaps this used to be a, a mine of sorts uh, so yes. you, you walked up towards this kind of raised, raised storage area but this storage area was completely picked clean nothing in it at all um, and decided to head on into uh, the next room, which is where we left. So, adventurers, you walk into this grand cavernous room with tables and seats and torches that light the flames with a small cooking area very far back. From where you are, uh, up here kind of raised, there's a slope that goes to the right, hugging the wall all the way down to the ground, and a small uh, like barricade of sorts up on the top of this ledge, s stopping people from falling, like a railing. Um, but the, instead of it being like a see-through, just two bars, and you can look through, it is like a, like a sh sheet of wood that's just hammered into the ground. Um, and as you walk in, seeing all of this, you hear growls. <laughs> coming from inside and one of these growls sounds a lot more guttural a lot deeper than the previous wolves that you've uh, discovered and not wanting to make yourselves known you will hide behind the small barricade nice. okay the chaos campaign what would you like to do ooh can we oh, what can we do? I mean, we got we weapons, right? I mean, can we see them? You can peer over and have a look. Uh -oh. <clears throat> you were able to catch oh, wait, in kind of the the uh yeah, you were able to catch like kind of the grand description of this room, but the small nitpicky details you have to like actually look at um and these growls and this this guttural growl kind of shook all of you so you decided to hide before you can just really stand there and have a look but you're welcome to uh -huh. welcome to peer isn't there like we have spells right that is correct yep. on. if you get up your character I think sheet that... yeah i'm pulling it up right now Wait, I'm just getting my character sheet up. Give me a second. I might have something that could help us in this situation. Oh, by the way, guys, uh, I totally forgot. Uh, just to stroke my own ego for a second, um, I got the second yeah. highest mark for my uni portfolio. Thank you nice. very much. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, Fuck yeah. Con congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. It was congratulations. A, it was a 65. <laughs> Damn. That's well, actually I'm... really fucking good. Seven, 17 wow. was the top mark. Damn. Oh, no, 17 is not in Well, se 70 <laughs> is just a first. You can get up to 100, but 70 is, is yeah. the highest mark. Really fucking good. I, had, I, I never even got a... I think I got maybe got one first. Yeah. I'm yeah. hoping I'm That's... hoping my songwriting, I'll get a first, because I write songs all the time. I only ever Hopefully. got first right. for um, essays and dissertation. 
Oh, yeah. Or oh, writing actually, shit, not drawing shit. Appar- appar- according to Jay, um, I have I might have a, a hundred on my uh, individual lessons, like my drum lessons. Oh, my God. Damn, oh, okay. my God. That's amazing. You're going to be like the best drummer a ever. Prodigy. <laughs> we got a prodigy on the hands. <laughs> Yeah, that's like the band. Um. Okay. Anyway, I have this anyway. one one spell um called the Hunter's Mark, but there's like something weird next to it. One d six star, and like there's a gable next to it. What does oh, that mean? Damage. Yeah, so uh, I believe without looking at the spell, it's uh you can mark a creature, and whenever you do damage to that creature, you get to do ad- additional damage. Okay, so so like, mm. does the creature have to be within sight for me to do that? Yes, so you choose a creature you can see within range, which is 90 foot, uh, and you mystically mark it as your quarry. Until the spell ends, which is concentration up to an hour, you deal an extra 1d6 to the target uh, whenever you hit it with a weapon attack. And you have mm. advantage hey, on any perception or survival checks you make to find it. Okay, so like if I do a perception or perception check on it, which means like I could find it and then I could make a spell, right? I think you have to see it, surely. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You just all you have to do is see it. How big's the room we in? Uh, this room is probably about a hundred. 120 feet long with about and about 50 foot wide maybe 65 70 it's a big okay. it's a big cavernous room and from the from the kind of the grand details that you're able to gather before hiding you you can kind of guess with the tables and the chairs that this is some sort of dining room with a small little kitchen area kind of in the far side from where you are okay. how much light is in the room uh, it's lit by torchlight so it's quite well lit Okay. Is there any food left on the tables? You would have to <laughs> peek out and peer to see these finer details. I would like to do that. Okay. Uh, so, standing, kind of standing up and peering over this wooden barricade, you can see five medium wolves kind of stood, like, prowling around, <laughs> sniffing, uh, and you can see this, like, gargantuan black-furred wolf who's oh, probably fuck. about twice the size of all the other wolves, with this large mm. scar across his face, uh, kind of from, like, top left forehead all the way down past his neck up the side of his uh, body. Pretty. Uh, guys, I think the big bad wolf is on the table <laughs> over there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they're all kind Yikes. of just, like, prowling. Growling slightly. They seem on edge. Okay. Um. Can I can I peek over and uh, do the hunter's mark thing on that wolf? Yeah, do it on big on, boy. On, on the big boy. The big one. Okay. And I assume I assume you want to do this stealthily. Yeah, with make, stealth. Make a sleight of hand check. Yeah. As you try to weave your magic and cast it without arousing suspicion. How do you spell suspicion. slight? Uh, S-L-E-I-G-H-T, right? No, I. I-E. No, E-I. I-E? Yeah. <laughs> slight, yeah. I got it right. I got it right the first time, then I typed it, and I was like, wait, that's weird. Then I swapped the E and I around. I was like, no, that's even weirder. Is this right? Oh, okay. Well, the uh, so you no. <laughs> you your grimoire floats out of your pocket as you prepare a spell. By the way, I think that was your last spell slot. Um, yeah. And you you try to like flick your magic kind of up the corner of the uh, of the uh, the this cavern to get it out of sight. But as it leaves the barricade, uh, Frumple, you can see this because you're still peering. Uh, the big wolf turns his head towards you and locks eyes with Frumple as this hunter's mark goes around and lands into his body. Um, 
uh, ma- uh, Maelor, you can, you as soon as the hunter's mark hits him, you can you can see into kind of its inner workings. You can't see like not like X-ray vision, but you get this overwhelming sense that uh, you two are kind of connected, and that you you can you know where to hit it best to get the most like lethality out of it. You are clairvoyant with it now. Okay, so can I attack it now? Uh, you can. Or do I have to wolf, wait? The wolf is staring oh. at Frumpool. And you have okay, a quick can I second throw... to do It's like a bludgeoning thing, right? Uh, what? The, my attack with, with Hunter's Mark. The I, most uh, damage just, would be a bludgeoning any. attack. It's just any. Oh, okay. You get to roll a d6 <laughs> on any damage you do. Okay, I'll throw my javelin at it then. Okay, make a dexterity. Uh, and add t- four. Oh, wait. No, yeah, that's that's melee. Never mind. Yeah, add four. Oh, check this dexterity. Plus four. Yeah. Is that how you do it? Yeah, or you could do... Uh, there is another one, so I think I still have Dom up here. So you could do exclamation attack. Yeah, so uh, so if you do that, exclamation attack, and then write javelin. I'm going to do unarmed strike, because that's the only one he has. Uh, Dom is a sorcerer. See, it, it does that for me. So yeah, if you do exclamation attack space javelin. Hey! And you get to roll an extra d6 of damage. Oh wait, that's oh, that's yeah. in, that's incorrect because that's using your strength. So oh, no. uh instead of minusing <laughs> instead of minusing two to the damage, we or minusing one, we add two. So it's actually eight points of damage. Plus an extra d6, so yeah. do you, Exclamation R space one D six. Just like that. Max damage. So that's fourteen points of damage. Okay. Ooh. This javelin <laughs> crashes into the side of the wolf. <laughs> oh, well, I'm gonna need to. I'm gonna sort my mic out because. It, it doesn't like me howling for some reason. <laughs> it's okay. We can howl for you. Well, that's, did that pick up that time? Yes, yes, it hey, picked up. There we go. And uh, I'm going to need everyone to roll initiative. So what actually I'm going to do, because I want you guys to learn more about Avre, is don't, 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 don't do anything yet. Don't do anything yet. Okay. <laughs> I need you to do... Exclamation I space join. This is going to roll your initiatives for me. And it's going to keep track of the combat. Uh, I do need to do one thing to the dire wolf though. Because you just hit it. For... That was 12... Wait, yeah, six, I'm level six, 10. 14. No. No, you're not. Patience. Underscore. <laughs> okay, yeah, so that was everyone. So I'm going to add... And then the arguments are in these ones. I don't think it's going to add those wolves, do you? Oh. Oh, I accidentally deafened. <laughs> why is it not Why is it not adding stuff? Hold on. Oh, that's why. I'm an idiot. Come on. Oh god damn it. Hmm. 
You can do it. Okay, I'm just gonna have to go the long way about it. Where you going? That's three. What do you mean wrong usage? Okay. It means wrong usage. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, bad joke. Okay, that is the turn order for this combat. Okay. Right. Nice. So, uh, and I, uh, you guys are going to be doing something a little bit different to me because my wolves are not the wolves that Avre has got. So, let's start off with Maelor. You get, yeah. You get another turn, so you just throw this javelin, it's landed in the wolf, he's gone, Aww! and you are the first to move. Okay, um, it, did it die? <laughs> it did Obviously not die. Not. It just seems pissed okay. off. Okay. Oh, can I attack it again then? Yeah, you have used your javelin though. Oh, you fuck. thought he was gonna okay. die. You just, you, you just threw your javelin. <laughs> I could be hopeful, okay. <laughs> uh, Let me summon a javelin out of thin air. So you do have, you do have a longbow. Uh, yeah, yeah. I was thinking about that, the longbow one. Can I do that? You may. I want, I want to shoot at it. So okay, if you're so. shooting at the, if you're shooting at the, uh, dire wolf, uh, do this one. So attack. Do 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 do. Long that will attack the dire wolf with your longbow. Okay. I don't have eight HP. By the way, I have. Ten. It's a D I one. Well, ac according to your D and D Beyond, apparently you have ten eight. I'm on my D and D Beyond, and I have ten. Oh, maybe everyone needs to update their thing. How do I do that? So I tweet. Right, you do have ten, so I'll just heal you quick. Oh that shit! <laughs> Oh, nice. Okay, so... <laughs> fuck! Maylor pops up, not even having to use her hunter's mark, and just whoo, fires an arrow straight through the dire wolf's eye. He goes... <laughs> crashes to the ground. Dead. What? <laughs> Why <laughs> just kill the one? <laughs> you thought you would have died. <laughs> That was... Okay, bonk. I take everything back. <laughs> that was supposed to be a longer boss fight, but there are five more wolves to I deal mean, with now. I mean, anything can happen. Like, last time Nobi killed a wolf with just... What? I don't even remember. <laughs> okay, so this wolf is a bit far away to run up to and attack in his turn, but he's going to dash move, run up the slope, and stand there guarding the way down. Uh, let me just make a note of that. Okay. Okay. He's going to reinforce his buddy. Oh yeah, I think she killed us with a dart last time. Yeah. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, and then this one's going to stay at the bottom of the ramp. Uh, 
<laughs> Why are you angry reacting? <laughs> Alright, Frumpel. Yeah, it still hasn't given you your health back, Nilor, so I'll just... Uh... I know, it's your turn. Frumpel. Yes. China! It's your, yes. it's your turn. I thought it was doing the check automatically. What do you mean? I thought that's what we signed up for just now. Wait, what do you mean? <laughs> no. I don't I don't understand what you mean. It, oh, is what, it is it my turn to move? What it takes your turn for you? No no no, I don't know. What would be the point of playing no. that? <laughs> no, that's not what I meant. I thought you said it was my turn to type in something. Well it's your turn to do something, yeah. Um I wanna fucking defend myself. Okay. There's nothing so there's nothing currently attacking you. I feel like Bonk is gonna go for the wolf and it'll go for me. No, I already killed the wolf. So yeah. like you know. Yeah. You killed one you of the You missed the whole thing. I didn't miss the whole thing. <laughs> I missed the bit you where missed... I turned on the extraction and then I realized I couldn't hear. Ah. Okay. Yes. He's slowly gonna lose his I patience. <laughs> I know. Like three <laughs> more wolves. So, so two wolves two no, wolves I ran don't... up the ramp and another wolf stayed at the bottom of the ramp. So your way down is now blocked. <laughs> okay. Um I guess we should remove him. <laughs> yeah, okay. but I don't wanna go near it. <laughs> Why didn't you pick it so, up and send him aside? So you want to make a ranged <laughs> attack? Yep. Okay, with with what weapon? With my bow and arrow. With your long bow? Yeah, I only had the one bow. Okay. Well, bow and arrow is very too generic. <laughs> so you want to do... <laughs> And then how do how how do how do I make a calculator yeah. then? So Check the, the, chat. the the closest wolf to you is wolf number three. So where it says target, just put W O three. Uh, oh, you... fuck, the eye wasn't simple. Yeah. Yeah, you need to lowercase that eye. Also, you might want to lowercase the T as well. Oh, oh no, oh. what? You attacked with an unarmed strike, though. But I attacked the longbow. <clears throat> yeah, it, this one didn't even target either. Huh? Show me, Show me just what you typed then. I think like, uh, it's gone really soft all of a sudden. Okay, so the other thing you can do is exclamation R space 1D20 uh, plus 6. Hello? Hello? Oh, we lost her. Rip in peace. But <laughs> Bonk, you're, you're there, aren't you? Yeah, she's in the kitchen right now. Oh, okay. Oh. And let me go and get her. No, she, she's here now. She came back. I couldn't hear. Can you hear now? Yeah, can you hear us now? I can. Yeah, I can hear her now. Once in a while, my Discord fucks up. I don't know. The, the voice channel. So, the other thing you could do is that, but then it won't automate it. I'll have to do it. Okay, it's, it's, it's very small. Let me show Okay, I can't hear anything before now. Okay, so what, what you have to do is type in, um, what did you say, Lewis? So she can either uh, do... this one. Uh, she this can either one. do the oh. exclamation I space attack space longbow space minus T space WO3 or exclamation R space 1D20 plus 6. But if she does the shorter one, I'll have to do the automation. That's a natural 20. So... Oh. Roll roll damage. It's a one d eight plus two. One d eight plus two. Plus two. Plus. What? What? Yeah. 
put it in the but Okay, so uh, because it was a critical hit, we doubled the 6 to a 12. And so that's 14 points of damage to wolf number 3. Nice. Nice. Which kills it. Yay! This arrow, Yay! This arrow flies... This is way easier through. than expected. It flies coming straight through. into its jugular. And just blood starts pure pouring over the ground. Just falls to the ground. Oh, that was a good wolf song. Yeah, I like Thank it. You. I like the I wine. Have, <laughs> I have killed many wolves in my time. Wait, why does yeah, it say I have 10 out of 16 hit points? <clears throat> I have 15. So Okay, well. I will you still you haven't question. healed, I think, from the other I one. No, no. Her, her, I have 15. Her D&D Beyond says differently. Oh. Which is did fine. Did the wolves come in? So, uh, so the, did the wolves all come in from the same place? What does that mean? They so they oh, were they... in this room, yeah. Yeah. They were they in this in room. The, from the you but came they, into this so, room. That's what I meant. But they all stood in the same place when we come in the room. So, uh, like, should they I update? Were, you know they were right? they were stood near each other. No, because that does that doesn't fix it. I will heal you myself. Okay, so okay. Wolf, thank you. Wolf you had fifteen. Two. Yeah. So there wolf one and wolf two are still next to each other. Well, no, they're not touching. No. Oh no, no, obviously, but they're close, within about fifteen feet of each other, right? I would say exactly fifteen feet. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, are there any other wolves within fifteen feet? No, the other two are currently up the, the path. Okay, how far away am I from those two wolves? Uh, the t the wolf right at the top, I'd say probably about fifteen feet. Uh, okay, what about those two that are fifteen feet within each other? They're probably they're like far at the far end, so, oh, so eight, okay. eighty, eighty, ninety feet. All right. Um, I'm just gonna go for that wolf that's fifteen foot away. Okay, wolf Actually, number four. Mm, wait, let me let me let me think. Uh. Bro, I can't believe you killed my dire wolf. Oh shit, I forgot to take my meds. <laughs> With a bow and arrow. In it. <laughs> my big boss for the dungeon. Dead before the fight happens. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. What oh I'm my actually, god, my what mic I'm gonna was do... off for my big evil laugh. No, no, we heard it. I mean, I heard it. I don't know if... <laughs> no, we didn't hear it. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. What I'm gonna do, I assume these... <clears throat> I assume these wolves can move over 80 feet in one turn, so... I'm gonna move about 20 feet forward towards the two wolves. You can't. You're so you're oh. you're on a raised platform, and there's a slope that goes down. This platform oh. is probably about it's twenty five, thirty adorable. feet up, with this slope kind of skirting around the wall down. You can jump off. Yeah, I, I, I yeah, I'm gonna just attack the wolf that's right in front of us. Okay. <laughs> so that's uh, wolf number four. What are you gonna attack with? I'm gonna attack with my double. Double rapier, short sword combo. Okay. Cool. So make your first attack by doing exclamation I space attack space the first weapon that you're doing um, space minus T. I, exclamation I space attack space the weapon you're using. Let me spell out. Let me make sure I spell that right. Yeah, then then uh so after the weapon it's space minus T to choose a target. 
and your target is W O four O or zero O for like the o. first two letters of wolf okay. four. four is that it? that should be it nice good hit this is your rapier sink straight into its shoulder and you come down with your other wow. weapon okay. that was cinematic <laughs> <laughs> um, I... just wait until the door creaks that's my favourite noise effect <laughs> it's a long sword isn't it no it's a short sword short sword yeah so exactly the same just replace rapier with short sword How do you spell sword? S W O R D. Sword. Sword. A sword. W O D. Four. Do I do yep. like a minus two? Because I think I've got a plus two on it. You know. Uh, that will do it to your hit. Uh, don't worry about that. I will give it health if needed. I uh, misses is so you you sink with the rapier, um, and now the wolf is very attentive to you. It sees the short sword coming and oh, just that? barely ducks underneath your swing. Mm. Rip. Okay. Yep, that wolf is dead. <laughs> ah, who would have known? Okay, wolf number one. Uh, this motherfucker is going to reinforce the dude at the bottom of the ramp. And do nothing else because that was his entire move. And wolf number two is actually going to go and uh, sniff the corpse of its leader. And start like, start like nudging it, trying to wake it up. Some sort of fetish. That is sad. <laughs> what do you mean fetish? There's, there's, there's two kind of people in this world. <laughs> um, that's that's all that wolf is gonna do. It's just kind of whining, just like nudging the big wolf. Erotically. No. <laughs> Why? Get, get out of my game. You? Get leave. Just leave. <laughs> Okay, Vale. Okay, where am I? You're, uh, right you're stood with everyone, uh, and mm -hmm. uh, Nilor is kind of stood mm -hmm. in front of a wolf that he's just jabbed with his rapier. Okay, am I close enough to use a melee weapon? Yeah, yeah, you can run up. You can actually run past the wolf to get advantage on your swing by flanking. Okay, let's do that. <laughs> I'm going to use my long sword. Attack the one that is in front of Harry. Or okay. Nilo. Are you uh, attacking one-handed or two-handed? One-handed. Okay. So yeah, do that. Uh, command, exclamation, attack that one. Or exclamation, I, space, attack. Okay, exclamation, I, space, attack. That's it? Space, long sword. Oh, okay, sorry. Sorry. That's all right. Uh, 19 for yeah. 4 points of damage. That's fine, you didn't pick uh. a target. That's fine. Uh, HP W04 minus 4. You slay the wolf as your longsword comes down into its back. <laughs> How about that, man? This is way easier than expected. <laughs> All right, back up to the top of the round, Maylor. Um, yes, yes, I'm here. So two wolves remain in the fight with the, the third now. wolf nudging, like trying to wake up the uh, previous leader that you had just murdered. I don't know which one is my place. Okay, okay, hang on. 
Oh. China's still here. Something's going on. Oh. Let's all blame Fishy. Okay. Yeah. yeah Fuck you, Fishy. Fuck you. Fuck you very, very much. Last time was fuck you, Harry. This time it's fuck you, Fishy. Stick around next week for fuck you, Lewis Day. Yeah. It's always fuck you, Lewis Day. Yeah, that's very true. Oh, shit. That's why, that I, that's why Harry's a bully on my server. Yes. <laughs> I like cyberbullying you. Don't want to uh, bully you in real life. But it's because I'm cyber easy bullying. to bully. I'm, cyber, cyber bullying. I'm so sorry. I've, I've been talking with the mute on. <laughs> It's uh, my didn't turn. You know, it got you got disconnected. You're like you're you're fine, or whatever you're using. No, like we we switched to China's phone because we're in the same place. Oh right, yeah, yeah. yeah and and China forgot that it was on mute. Okay, so I would need you to repeat <laughs> everything. It's a fishy here. Yeah, yeah. So okay, fishy. so is it is it my turn? Yeah. Yes, and uh, did fishy hear us just then? Yes. Okay, yeah, Fishy's on his own phone. Fuck you very, very Whoa. much. Okay, Lewis Allen. Because <laughs> <laughs> our names both start with an L. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay, is um are any of the wolves injured? Uh no, these are all untouched. Okay. Yeah, Can I just... use my hunter's mark again? Yeah, so there's something about that, and that you should have done this last turn, but it's my fault. When oh. uh, when oh. your target dies, you can spend your bonus action to move your hunter's mark. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't. I can't hear that. You can um. you can you can spend your bonus action to move your hunter's mark without having to recast it. Oh, okay. How do I do that? You just say you do it. Who do you want to move it to? Oh, I want to move it to the one. Um, is is there a wolf like on the on the incline or whatever? There are two wolves at the bottom of this incline. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Um. The one 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 of the wolves on the bottom, like maybe to the right. Okay, that'd be wolf number five. Yeah, wolf number five. Okay, yeah, you move your hunter's mark, focus in your mana, and you now gain a link with this wolf and gauge a better idea of how to hurt it. Okay. So that was your um, bonus action, you still have a main action. A long ball. Okay, make an attack. Wait, what did I do the last time? Oh, you you did exactly that. You attacked with your longbow. <laughs> no, no, no. I mean, what did I type? That's what I would print. So this oh, is okay. I found it. Wolf number. I five. found it. I found it. Attack. Longbow. And then to target, you do dash T. Yeah. I one. No, no, no! You—that was the dire wolf. The dire wolf is dead. Oh. You killed the dire wolf. You don't need to kill oh, it okay. anymore. Yeah, it's, it's dead. Sorry. Dead. Come on. <laughs> so your new target sorry, is. Sorry, I wanted to do. Your new w target 5, is right? W O five. Yeah. Uh, can you roll? Can you roll a d six for me? One d six. Is yep. it minus or plus or anything? Nothing. No, nothing. So it takes another four points of damage from your hunter's mark as you find just the right tendon to pierce with your arrow. Yeah, the, the arrow hits. Oh. Boom! Kia! Arr! Arr! 
as this uh, this arrow is kind of now in its uh, in its chest, uh, spewing a little bit of amount of blood, and it kind of like curls up its body a little bit, getting quite tense. Okay, cool, cool. Well, okay. you're dead. So uh, you're also dead. So. <laughs> right, the wolf that you just attacked is, mate. If I don't get it to attack now, they're all gonna die. What can I do? It's their death day. What also can you do? You know what? Fuck it. This wolf is on the verge of death. He's just seen its leader die. He's gonna go for the attack. He's gonna go for a full on <laughs> bite. I thought we were going away. Oh yeah, that's gonna. That's gonna. Uh, you know where it is, right? I think I'll I forget how to attack yeah. with monsters. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Luckily, I have it bookmarked. Another one. Okay, so that should just work. <laughs> Damn, that's a miss. Uh, Vale, the the wolf comes sprinting up behind you, but you see it just in time to get your shield uh, in the way, and it just kind of its jaws clamp down harmlessly on your shield, and you shove it off. And it like does a little leap and turns back around. Take that bitch. Okay. Alright, uh, front pool. Okay. Um, I would like to attack WO5 with my long bow. Okay. <laughs> so do I first do the eye yep. exclamation I Yep, that you need to do that for every initiative command you're doing. Attack longbow. Yeah. Minus T. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm remembering it. Um. W O five. Yeah, I had to uh make it a lowercase W O five. No, you don't. It's not w found. W O five not the T found. You have to make lower. Yeah, it was lowercase. Oh, you have a zero instead of an O? Mm -hmm. a bit. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, you have a zero instead of an O. Yeah, it takes... I could have sworn I did a zero last time. It takes the first two letters of the enemy name. W-O. <laughs> Imagine if there was another thing that starts with W. <laughs> Wood. <laughs> Woodman. You attacked it with an unarmed strike again. But I said longbow. I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> Lewis, I did exactly what you said. I don't know what you're doing. <laughs> oh, oh, longbow has a capital L, is that it? Longbow is like in one word. Hold it, on. It is one, I did, I'm on. doing it as Hold one on. word, but... Because I just tried it and it didn't, and it didn't do it. Wait, so... wait, I'm trying again, Lewis. I bet you, do you have your longbow equipped? Yeah, is you your do. longbow like not equipped with you? No, it is. Can you just uh can you just do exclamation update for me? Alright, and then tr then then try it try it again. Wait, there's a couple of the okay, yeah, it should be fine. Bro, it's so hot, how can you I'm a fast reader. Oh. I've been eating like biting one at a time. <laughs> there we go. Yay! Yay! Some damage. So, it's uh, it's a little bit hard to get your shot past Brown Veil, but or Black Veil, and you see a split second where you you can fire a shot, and it goes into the wolf's hind leg, tear like all the way through 
tearing out this chunk of flesh as this blood just starts pouring out and it quickly bleeds to death. Bye. <laughs> Simply bye. Nilo. He's dead, dead. Nilo. Harry. That's your character, Harry. Harry, you're on mute. Oh, he's on mute. You're on mute. Harry! You might be in the bathroom or something. You're a wizard, Harry. Go. <laughs> <laughs> If you're in, if you're on your phone but on mute, can you type in the chat? Yes, I can. I don't Come know. On. Come on, Harry, you can do it. Maybe someone walked into his room. Maybe he peeing. Maybe. That's a long pee. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you want to yell at Charlie. Hold your bodily functions. Okay. <laughs> when my when my kidneys burst. Yeah. I expect point, right? I expect you to donate one to me. I Are will, you all positive? I will write your doctor a note. <laughs> Hello, sorry. It's okay. We don't accept your apology. Okay. <laughs> Five is dead. It is, yep. Okay. I killed it. You're welcome. I'm gonna go for wolf number. Whatever wolf next to number five. <laughs> wolf, wolf number one is also at the bottom of the. Oh um, gosh, yeah, I forgot there's wolf number one. I and two. Back. Both are healthy. Uh, right Wait, no, two as well? Yeah. yeah. Right here. Wait, I thought two was dead. Nope. No, two, um, four, five. That was four. What t uh, what T again? Uh, dash T minus minus, minus T. Dash T. Yeah, make sure it's just all lowercase oh, oh, oh. as well. T W O one number one. Uh, yes. Don't water. <laughs> okay, I'm you really rush up. You rush up to it and okay. stick it with your rapier, getting ready, getting ready to come down with your short sword. Right, here we and go. Get water. Um, and there's glasses on it. On the rack. Sword. Short <sighs> sword. T M W O 1. Come on, fingers crossed. Mm. Ah, fuck! Ah, uh, you're not very good with a duel, Lin. No, I'm not, am I? Second sword <laughs> comes down, phew, just slices right over its head. Missing by about half a foot. Shit. Okay. Oh. Well, now it's its turn to fight back, and you betcha it's gonna try and bite your ass. <laughs> do it, Wolf. Don't do it. And it succeeds. It also. Uh, oh, you succeed your strength save. Oh. Uh, so you're not you're not knocked on your ass. Um, but this wolf is pissed and it gnashes at your legs and pulls out this long string of uh, muscle and and it just starts pissing with blood immediately. Your uh, your adrenaline kicks in. Um, and you feel this sudden rush of energy. Uh. But that's only because, and you know that you are very close to death. Fuck no. Fuck her. There goes another. <laughs> Wolf number two. For anyone who's looking, um, gets uh, gets its head underneath the paw of the dire wolf. Um, and just lays down. Mm -hmm. And it, so now it looks like the dire wolf is like cuddling. Okay, juice if you want it. Yeah, it's like, it's like, cu it's like, like cuddling, cuddling this wolf. Okay, yeah. now it's getting creepy. <laughs> well, well, I mean, it's just that, yeah, yeah, that's, that's all <laughs> that wolf does. I don't know why it's creepy, it's supposed to be nice, but okay. Okay. 
Vale. He... Let him grieve. I'm gonna attack wolf number one. He's half dead. Okay. Might as well. Mercy killing. You're not gonna heal. I guess that, not. <laughs> that is a successful hit. As your long sword comes down. He did. And completely cleaves off the head of this wolf. Eh. Okay. Uh, oh, there's only one left. Yes, Who's, the grieving one. Next? Okay, Maylor. I'm gonna let you have the last turn of the fight. So the only wolf left is currently so it it like kind of nudged up a paw of the dire wolf uh to get itself like underneath its paw and just lay down with its uh dead leader. That is sad. You're on mute, if you didn't know. Okay, is it is it my turn? No. Yeah. Okay. Did you did time. you hear anything that I just said? Kind of. Emotional. <laughs> I missed yeah. it. So I can figure it out, right? This wolf, this wolf hasn't been touched, and it's not even been engaged in a fight. And it is okay. It is the to. opposite. Okay, I... It is the opposite of aggressive right now. Okay, so can I use animal, animal, animal? What chemy thing? Animal handling. Uh, animal handling. Try... Okay, make an animal handling check. Check animal handling. Oh wait, mine is so, like, my data is like really low. Oh no, it's actually working. Oh wait, it, it happened. So with a 10, you start to walk up to the wolf, um, and you're pretty familiar with animals and stuff, um, and you, okay. you gauge that this animal is depressed. Aww. Aww. It has no it, fight. It has no fight. It has no will. It just wants to seemingly lay there and die with its leader. Okay, I and grant okay, his wish. Guys, guys, look, look. This this animal wants to like you know delete itself. So like, <laughs> what is um, delete? <laughs> they, they they don't want to like fight us. Um. She's really sad. Stick to a pronoun. <laughs> Sorry, I can't. So okay, so I mean, with a with a ten, I don't know the, the... with a ten, I'll say you can gauge okay. it's a fe it's a female. Okay. It is, it is a she. So she's she's pretty pretty depressed, um, and I know it's a she because I checked. <laughs> 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 she's pretty depressed. She um, knows that the rules of the girl because she checked. <laughs> She knows what? that the rules are the girl. He checked. No, she didn't. She didn't check because she get her hand bitten off. No, she can oh, tell. Dear. She can tell by kind of the the overall structure of this wolf that you know. Sure, it's, sure. Yeah. yeah. Okay. She sure. studied. She studied wolves. I haven't. Guys, she depressed. She's depressed. She doesn't want to fight us. She just wants to die with her friends. Um, for grand for me, kill, kill her. All right, who, wants to, who wants to kill it? I oh, use bardic, is, bardic inspiration on the wolf. I feel you can't. like it's some... I can. You can, <laughs> you can make Are a you still... You can make a performance have... check to perform for the wolf. <laughs> I have bardic inspiration though. Harry, do you still have that motivational poster? <laughs> no, that that's that... that that was uh, That wasn't him. That was oh, the dragon. Oh shit, that was the dragon bird. Oh my god. Emotional nostalgia. Okay, so Harry, you really want to give it bardic inspiration. And also use an animal handling check. <laughs> okay, well... You... I'll just use an animal handling check. Okay. I want to be like... I want to be like a... Just give it inspiration through my bardic inspiration. I mean, you can, but it gets a... Pl it, all it gets will get the b benefit of that. So, make an animal handling check. Uh, I'm also I'm gonna end combat because combat for sure has ended. Oh fuck! 
Damn it. It's check animal I know. I want the wolf. Okay, so the, uh, as you kind of come up to it, making like cooing noises and just trying to calm it down and that, uh, once you get, once you get within about 10 feet, uh, she looks at you and starts growling. Oh, don't growl, calm down. <laughs> I get all the wolf ears. Okay, yeah. I... Vale, yeah. You, you collect... Uh, you collect We're gonna four... take everything. How do collect... I take the, the dire wolves? You collect four <laughs> pairs... Dire you collect four pairs okay. of ears as Maylor attempts to go towards the dire wolf. Okay, I give Maylor the dire wolf ears. Well, you haven't cut off the dire wolf's ears because as Maylor goes to collect the dire wolf's ears, she makes a mm -hmm. dex save. A what? A dex, a dex save. So how many ears do I have? Uh, you gain four pairs of wolf ears, so eight. Maylor, Maylor, please, yeah, please make a dex save. Uh, the wolf, the wolf comes leaping towards you and snaps its jaws. About a f about a foot away from your throat, uh, before backing up, like it. putting its putting Shit. its rear end kind of against the dire wolf, protecting it, and aggressively growling towards you. Yeah, you had to kill him. Or it's dire wolf not dead yet. The other wolf, the prote the wolf that was grieving that you felt bad for, is attacking you now. Did you hear any of that? Why me? No, not you. Because you went to get the ears. No, Maylor. Maylor. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, Maylor. That that was bone. Exactly. Yeah. It's me. Oh. I'm Maylor. I knew that. <laughs> Did you think that I was China? <laughs> no. <laughs> not a very fair I told thing you. <laughs> Lewis. You kid are you fucking kidding me? No. <laughs> That didn't happen. Anyway, continuing. <laughs> <laughs> After all we've been through. Oh, okay. So can I do something? Okay. Yeah, by all means. You can kill him. You know. Her. Her. Sorry. Let's let's stay gender neutral. You can kill it. I mean, it is a female group. They don't I care about the pronouns. It's a wolf. <laughs> Ah, uh, whatever. I check the room for loot other than wolf ears. Okay, make a perception check. I have no idea how to spell perception. Oh, 21. Do you want more? Did you okay. <laughs> so you find so okay so on this in this room are a bunch of uh, tables with uh, like plates and cutlery on, but they're all like wooden. Uh, uh, a few of them are like stone cups, but it's mostly like wooden cups and plates. Uh, some ta some tables okay. have been turned on, uh, upside, some so tables no have food. been broken completely. Well, I'm explaining what's in the room. Hello? Just be, be patient. Hello. Ugh, Hello. Don't, it's keep doing the... Anyway. Yeah. Um, Sorry, uh, I can't hear you. On, on, a, on a couple of these uh, plates are some very, very rotten food. Um... However, you do find a silver chalice. This is just this is just Nilor. You find a silver chalice, a gold necklace hidden inside one of the cups, and a lump of refined gold hidden in the cooking pot. Okay. 
So this this one isn't unrefined. This is re a re piece of refined gold. So it's just a lump of gold. Nice. Yeah. Shit. How how much? How big? Uh, I'd say probably about the size of a golf ball, maybe a bit less. Good. Still a decent amount. What's the inflation rate on gold? <laughs> well, the the coins you use to buy stuff are made of gold. You use it. Uh, you don't actually make a history check. Let's see if you know. What me? Yeah, yeah. You looking at this bit of gold going? I wonder how much I can oh. get for this. So make a history check. All right. Interesting. Uh, <laughs> uh, you either so <laughs> with a history check of six, you have no idea the value of gold, kind of as is when it's not been printed. Uh, so you you really have no clue. Cool. Oh, I'll, add, I'll add my things to my equipment. So back to the wolves or the wolf. Don't What the fuck was it sound? That was a wolf growling. <laughs> That is a very great sound effect. Thank you. It's not a sound effect, that's me doing it with my voice. I know, yeah, but that's what I meant. Like, oh, okay, thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> thank you. So, you could do so, what would you like to do? Well, we were wolf. any of us going to act right now because we're not in combat? Yeah, you can. Yeah. It's just kind of first come, first serve, do whatever you want. Oh, I'm going to move. I'm gonna wait, wait, wait. You don't get my javelin out of the out of the dire wolf. You you cannot get close to this dire wolf without losing a finger. I try to make that oh, clear. I attack me. him with my long sword. Okay, make an attack. So you Is won't this be wolf able, number you, what? You won't be able to target it because we're not in. So I just do. Ah. Uh, uh, oh God. You can just no. tell me what to die if you don't want to die great yourself. Yeah, okay, so yeah, do exclamation I attack longsword. Uh and then I'll I'll do the rest of it. Okay. This channel yeah, is that's that's what I combat. thought it would be. Uh okay, just roll roll a D twenty and add your modifier. E Twenty plus what is my modifier? Um, to hit with a long sword. Mhm. Mm plus four. Plus four? Is it? Yeah. yeah. Ew. All right, okay. this uh, this wolf it dodges <laughs> out of the way and goes oh. to, goes to try and bite you. Damn it. Imagine if you didn't have one fire. Yeah. <laughs> Are you what, kidding? What's your armor class? <laughs> Nineteen. It it manages to get like on top of you, like it leaps, but you get mm -hmm. just the edge of your shield in the way, just in the right time. To uh, to stop yourself from being bit, you can now you can slap the wolf with your sword again if you like. Yeah, I'm gonna attack him again. Yes, so no, no, I'm in it. There's no going back. Roll the G20. You're right. Was was this a bad call? <laughs> no, I just I'm tried. Wolf. I just tried to make you guys feel bad for killing my dire wolf in one hit. Ah, oh, there you go. Nineteen. That's good. That is. Did so now, see, now roll damage. That's a one d eight plus two. Oh. 
Seven yeah. points of damage. Yep. <clears throat> Come on, he gotta be dead. You slash your sword, <clears throat> and the wolf tries to dodge out of the way, but in doing so, it exposes its neck, and your sword just Hell drags yeah. across the wolf's throat as its growls turn into whimpers, as its whimpers turn into breathing. It limps over to the dire wolf and lays next to it before slowly bleeding to death. I don't think you feel bad about it death. now. Come on. <laughs> All right, I take the dire wolf's ears. I take the other wolf's ears. Okay, so Vale gets a pair of wolf ears, so add another two, and Harry, you get a pair of dire wolf's ears. Nice. Wait, Damn, what that's gonna be some expensive shit. Oh, hand me my dire wolf's ears right the fuck now. <laughs> no, I, I, I saw my opportunity, so I took it. Yeah, this is happening in character, by the way. Let me see. How is yeah. it yours? Like, you, because you I killed the him. Dire wolf. I killed the dire wolf with two hits. Okay. <laughs> the party like, is he giving it to her? <laughs> I get seniority. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got there first. And I don't care, I killed it first. Yeah, you could always just keep it. Attack He's him. standing in, the, in, in a mine. He's too fighting over a pair of ears. Find his keepers, it's my age now. No, I will wrench it out of your dead hands. <laughs> Cool. Okay, can we move on now? Alright, let's go. Yeah. So you see one final door mm -hmm. that leads deeper. Mm. That's cool. Okay, it is as simple as uh, just opening a doorway. Um, and I open the door. And you come into a small man made room, much like the hidden storage. Uh, of of a storage area. This room is filled with shelves that seem to have housed uh, various clothes and food. And without really searching, you can just see like various rotten food uh, and a bunch of ragged common clothing. Okay. Uh, I want to search the room for the like, gold and stuff. Make a perception check. Okay. Can I do the same thing? Uh, you can you can assist her. Okay, I want to assist. Okay, Vale, you get to roll twice. An eighteen, and then roll again just in case you get higher. Okay, so we take we take the eighteen, uh, and mm -hmm. you and Maylor find between you 48 silver pieces a silver tipped spear and a gold necklace wait a minute 48 silver pieces a silver tipped what spear spear and a gold necklace between yeah between the two of you so you both find those items okay okay we can divide the silver pieces equally what do you want to do with the spear and the gold necklace? Okay, um, I can take the gold necklace, you can take the spear. Okay, sure, sure. Okay, no. so that's... No. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Like, I hope you hey, find the gold. Hey, it was my idea, okay? I get the gold necklace. Okay, does well, this, I, is, does this is, spear I, have, like, special powers or something? <laughs> Uh, make, a, make an arcana check. Okay, I'm, make, I'm gonna make an arcana check. <laughs> Twelve, okay. Uh, there is no magic on this spear, uh, but yeah. you do know that silver-tipped weapons will cause damage to certain types of enemies. Oh. Okay. Can I know more about it? <laughs> Uh, you don't. 
Uh, besides, besides from you that, yeah. Besides from that, you don't really know much. Um, okay. I'll say okay. I'll say that uh, when learning the Paladin ways, you learn much about like undead creatures and cursed <laughs> creatures, and ty <laughs> typically these weapons are best used against like werewolves or certain types of trolls. Uh, and other things of that nature. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the spear then. Thank you can you. have yes, That's you can have lot. the money. You can have the money. <laughs> Do you give her all the, the all the pieces? No, 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 twenty four silver pieces. And the gold necklace. I get twenty four silver pieces. Can um, you make note of? I don't have my yeah, yeah. Coins. I have your old stuff to note it down. You have other like thirty silver coins and seventy nine copper. Do I add it to my uh, profile on the thing beyond? Uh, you can do. There won't. There probably won't be. Like you might have to make a custom item for a silver tip spear. I mean, there might be. Oh no, no. You just make. Yeah, you just get a spear, and then in the. Uh, in the customize options, you can click silver. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> uh, but besides from that, there's nothing else in this small little storage area, and that is the end. There's this uh, dungeon doesn't go any further. I want. Can I go back to the previous room? Yeah, yeah, back into kind of the. Uh, yeah, kind of I'm gonna go room. back there and. Like, uh, make a perception check over there as well. Can I uh, do that? You can. Yeah. It's like the end, right? I'm pretty sure I found most of it. Okay, okay, calm down, bitch. <laughs> wow, that is that is find, so bad. Do you want to find a wanna... rock you think is really valuable? Damn. I was actually gonna say you find a really oddly shaped rock that looks just like Nilor's head. <laughs> I, I pick it up and throw it at him. Okay. Ow! I'm only on three HP. I die. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I should I should mention that uh, Nilor, the adrenaline is wearing off, and it hurts like hell as your skin goes incredibly pale. Oh, oh, I'm already dying. dying. Can I? Okay, so my skin uh, is basically white. How can I go even more pale? Exactly. <laughs> Somehow more pale. You're, you're basically translucent right now. All right. Um, <laughs> before we leave, I want to go and skin the direwolf. Oh my god! The wow, lovely. why, man? Why do you do that kind <laughs> of shit? It's a fucking direwolf. That pelt's gonna go for a lot. Make, okay, fine. Uh, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say that you can't. Why? I want because to for start for starters, you know nothing about skinning animals, and for second, <laughs> you are. I I would I would have allowed you to make a survival roll of disadvantage, but because you're on the pretty much on the cusp of death, and it's hard to walk. Skinning a massive direwolf is going to be impossible if you don't know how to do it. Okay, can I try uh, with disadvantage? Well, no, I, I, the only way I would do it is if you had disadvantage on your disadvantage, and that doesn't exist in D&D. &D. Oh, let me Lewis, Lewis, let me do it. And I grew up on a farm. I know everything about skinning animals. No. Okay, well, I will I will allow as Nilor hobbles his way to the direwolf. Do you have a dagger? You guys. Yeah. Oh, God. I, I think so. I have a dagger. Okay, well, okay. Nilor, Nilor starts, like, limping towards the body with his short uh, you... sword in hand. You're, well, like, half yeah. dead and you want to skin a wolf. <laughs> okay. You're fine. Are you going to assist me? No, I want to do it by myself. But I'm already trying to skin it. Well, yeah, I mean, nah, um, I, Nilor, I Nilor didn't make it known. He wasn't like, hey, guys, I'm going to skin this direwolf now. Hey, guys, so... I'm going to go and skin that direwolf. Oh, okay, there you go. 
I'm gonna come help you. Come on. Oh, nice. Thanks. <laughs> okay, good luck. Right, we'll and do that. Okay. Gonna use two. So now, Harry, mm -hmm. make a survival check at disadvantage. Yes. Yeah, it it doesn't like it doesn't. Oh, it worked for you. Wait, no, that did advantage. Oh no, it did disadvantage. Nice. Yeah. Sixteen. Fuck. So, you having never skinned an animal before in your life, but being assisted by the paladin, are able to cut. Uh, I'll say probably about a three foot by three foot square of fur. Quite nice, but you kind of butcher the rest of it. Uh, I'll also say you get you get some uh, good cut. You get some good cuts of meat as well. You probably get about two days worth of meat for your whole party. Oh. Uh, and I totally forgot about the other two people in this entire campaign. So far. Okay, let's just kill them off. Well, no, they just they've just kind of been stood at the back. Just watching us too. Yeah, well it was easy to kill these wolves, so they were like, eh, they got it. Okay. Um Dire Wolf. Bear. Yeah, three foot by three foot. Oh, I remember that, I'm sorry. And then about two days worth of wolf meat. Okay. Shit. I love peaches. Yes, yeah, but, but you kind of also, butcher. You kind of butcher the rest said... of the body. Well, yeah, because okay. I'd like to. Okay, Harry. Lovely. If you sell the skin, I get half of it because it helps you out. Oh yeah, that's that's completely fine. That's okay. Yeah. Okay. May I take the liver? <laughs> make make a it. make a survival check. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to eat it. Uh, you get you get a piece of the wolf's organ that you think is the liver. <laughs> Maybe it's kidney. Um. Okay, I eat it. Wrong. I can eat it. Oh can I gosh. steal? Can I steal the skin from Ningo? Can I steal it? No, uh, I step in front of you and I'm like, back off. Yeah. Come on, it's not cool. I, you don't know what I'm talking about. I'm talking to God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on. Pause, pause, pause. Okay, so... <laughs> um, Frumpel, you eat the strange meat. Uh, mm -hmm. And being a tiefling, uh, you're pretty robust to this kind of stuff. Uh, when I play a tiefling... I, I very much like to eat raw meat, so yeah, you're, it's totally fine for you. Cool. Um, I don't. She, she's mad at me. As to the stealing, make a stealth check. As you me? hide, uh, me. May, Maylor. As you okay. hide, as you hide behind. Uh, a table trying to get out of view from everyone. Wait, who's stealing it? <laughs> Maylor, Maylor, no, no, no. There's, there's steps up to taking the item. She's got to hide from you first. Okay, you hide, you hide behind a table and think, think, you think you're out of sight. Uh, everyone else. Everyone else, you see Maylor just duck behind the table, and you can see her right now. <laughs> Alright, Maylor. Maylor, now that you're perfectly hidden behind the table, what would you like to do? <laughs> can I steal it? I'm stealing it. Okay, Sorry, so, stealthy of you. you guys, you guys see, you guys see Maylor come out from 
uh, the side of the table and like in a slow crouch go towards uh, Nilor, who immediately turns around and looks at Maylor in the face. I tell her to fuck off. <laughs> he does that. Okay, let me just put this. Check intimidation. No, oh, no, no. We don't. We don't do that. That's... We don't do that here. How you were slightly intimidated. No, play player player on player interaction is purely role play. Okay. Okay. Um, Mailor, do you do you wanna make a perception check in this room with my assistance? Uh, oh sure, why not? So I will okay. say before before you do that, you um you notice that everything has been upturned. Things have been thoroughly searched through. I have okay. almost everything, guys. Are you really searching around now? Okay, never mind then. <laughs> okay, uh, Chris Fi. Yes. I was trying to add the spear in my inventory. So there are like multiple options. Spear plus one plus two wishes. Spear it's just it's just two. a just a normal spear. But how do I customize it to silver tipped? If you add if you add the spear to your inventory. Mm -hmm. Then once it's in your inventory, you can click it. Click customize. Oh, okay, I see it now. And then it will say silvered. I see in the drain. Mm, yes. Thank you. For your assistance. It is okay. Alright guys, what do you want to do? It? Yeah, it feels light. <clears throat> feels light in your hand, uh, and it's quite long as well. <laughs> uh, <laughs> All right, guys. Oh, should we get out of here? Yes, let's go. Okay. All right. So stepping over the wolf's corpses, making your way back through. Uh, you come outside uh, and the uh, the moon hangs high in the sky. You've been in this cave for some time, but the sun is kind of just, just barely breaching over the horizon. <coughs> uh, and because uh, <coughs> there are there are two moons of Darud and one of them sits kind of nice and high in the sky. There also uh, a sandstorm. No, but that is the reference. Well done. Okay, now Guys, outs now outside. Now we've, now we've got outside. I feel something happening. After being in there with all these sounds for so long, I just oh. Okay, I'm done. Okay, fair enough. Yes. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, let's head back to the um the hut thing place that farm. gave us the quest. The, the farm. farm. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Cool. Alright. You head on your journey and for the sake of expedience. It takes you I think it was about a day, a day's travel to get there. Uh and you rock up, you rock up to the farm, just kind of in the breach of morning, um, and you see the orc who, uh, who gave you kind of the directions to go, and he waves you down. Huh. Adventurous. Mm -hmm. Hello there. Hey. General Kenobi. I don't know Are who you? that is. <laughs> How are you? We've, we've, uh, you know, we killed those wolves. I trust it went well. Yeah, it, it did. It did. It did. It did. That is good to hear. Do you hear that, family? We are finally rid. Hey. Everyone has hey. a cheer. Hey, guy. You, you, look, yay. Hey, guy. You look, you look a bit cold. How, 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 like, you know, how warm are you? 
Well, <laughs> that is I, a weird uh, question. I'm a bit of a thick-skinned orc, so I'd have to say I'm pretty snug. Why is that, nice. adventurer? Do you, do you like wolf pellets? Yes. Well, we use uh, we use wolf pellets for the stables and other mm. things of such. Uh, have you got a dire wolf pellet? Would you? There was a dire wolf in that cave, was there? Oh yeah, yeah. Or well, where they were? Ah, I see. <laughs> and you. We got a oh. bit of its skin if you want it. I mean, for well, a price. May I? Know. May I have a look? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I pull it out. Oh. Hold it up in front oh, of me. Oh God! You haven't tanned it yet. Oh God, that's disgusting. It's still dripping with blood. Oh. Oops. Well, Sorry. Yeah, Do you know how to tan not... it? Like? You should. Do you know how to tan it? God no! I buy all of the uh, tanned furs from the town. Oh. Oh. I'm a simple wheat farmer. I not know how to tan. Okay, maybe you can go into the town and like okay, sell it I'll... to the people who sell tan um, versions of it. I I slowly I look at it like a <laughs> uh, uh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I roll it back up. I look in my bag. I'm like, oh, oh shit, everything's bloody, and I just chuck it back <laughs> in. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, okay, okay, nothing happened. There's a there's a place run by the Jackman Fold group. Mm, you should okay. head there. It's a leather workers. Ooh, nice. Is there any is there any weapon shops near? I'm looking to Oh, I weapon. there's a there's a few weapon shops. There's uh the the one in particular. Where did it go? Uh, hold on, I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> yes, there, there, there is a weaponsmith in town. However, oh, nice. that is run by the Sam family. Okay, what's up with them? The Sams? Yeah. Uh, do you not know much about the town of Megaton? Uh, not, not too much. Wait, wait, aren't, aren't, aren't I from Megaton? Yeah, you are, so you do. Oh um, <laughs> wait. There are yes. there are there are four <laughs> there are four families that, that run the town. You have uh you have the Jackman Fold, you have the Sams, you have the Josh, and you have the Lewises. Oh <laughs> the Lewises. What, what did the Lewises do? I asked I asked uh, this was a while ago. I asked you guys for some names, and these were the names I got. Oh, uh, so you know, you know that uh, the family of Lewis's are considered the richest of the four families, and as such, their HQ isn't treated as their home, but rather another arm of their business. Ooh. Fancy. Uh, they. So okay, well, so the the Lewises are mostly about like wine, alcohol, that kind of thing. Uh, the Sams uh, is a group of dwarves, um, and their kind of trade is metal and wood. Oh, okay. Uh, the Josh family is uh, kind of silver, stone, like built like, uh, like uh, like armory. Uh, kind of stuff, uh, and the the Jack manifolds are. Uh, do, 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 do. Who said Jack manifold? I can't remember. Oh right, and the the Jack manifold they uh, they kind of run the the like town guard. So all of all of the guards are. Okay, cool. Under the Jack so, Manifolds. Okay, I'll continue the conversation with this dude then. So how far is Megaton, roughly, at the moment? Uh, well, you actually know this. Okay, I ask myself. Uh, because <laughs> you... Sorry, I'm just adding stuff to my map. Because I can't remember, if I'm honest. Uh, it is about two days. Two days' journey. Good, sir. Because we have... Uh, Anquished these wolves. Do you mind if we take a rest in your humble farm? Of course, we have a stable just over yonder. Please stay oh, sure. as long oh. as you need. 
cool. Because a couple of our party feels very comfortable on farms. And this will be like returning home to them. Well, I'm glad we could make you comfortable. Also, do you have some food and drinks? That yes, by all means. Thank you. I shall bring some food and drinks over to your, over to the stage. Thanks so much. Of course. Thank you for ridding us of that plight. Oh, okay. no worries. Glad also, to help. Um, talk about food and me. Um, do you know anything about cooking dire wolf? <laughs> I've never cooked a dire wolf in my life. How good are you at cooking? I, I think I'm great. And you just see, you see a couple of the children tending the fields just look at you and just like shake their heads about it. Like, yeah, I'm a pretty good cook, he says. And the kids are like, <laughs> kids are like, no, no. Okay. But, Who's... but my wife is is the best cook. Ooh. Does she know anything about cooking dire wolf? As I've said, we've not had a dire wolf come this way ever. Does she know anything about cooking wolves? Yes, yes. My my wife makes a a fine wolf stew. Oh, oh, that sounds nice. I, I give her, I walk over well, to the wife. it's just him. No, you can't oh, see okay. the wife. I, I go, hey, could you ask your wife to, I give him about a day's rations of. Um, yeah, that's, that's like a day's for all of you. All of us. Well, it's one meal, isn't it? One, yeah, one, yeah, one meal for all of you, really. Oh, okay. I give him, I give him all of it. Yeah. You give him both, both days yeah. worth of rations. Yeah, actually no. Stew could last quite a, could go quite a long way with a small amount of meat, so I only give him one. Okay. And say very well. She, could she make a stew out of this? Of course, I will give this. Oh, this is some hefty meat. Mm. We shall bring it over to the the stables as soon as it's ready. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate that. Let's of go, course. you guys. Get a okay. long rest. So you see this kind of like, you see this kind of wooden, wooden structured thatched roof building, uh, and there's a single donkey inside of it. There's a couple piles of hay, uh, and two of the children, uh, orcish children, come up and hand blankets to all of you. Aww. And as soon as you t as soon as you take them, they run away giggling. Your kids. Okay, thank you. I appreciate the blankets. Thank you, children. Alright, sleep time. You just gotta oh, sleep right gonna... now. Oh, wait. Yeah, we're gonna take a long rest, and when we wake up, we'll have stew ready. Oh, yeah, stew, stew can take quite a while. Yeah, let's have a long rest. Yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep. I'm gonna take a long rest. Yeah, because you know everything about cooking stews, don't you, Nilo? Fucking bod. <laughs> <laughs> I am sensing some anger. <laughs> I just don't like bod. She loves me. No, I didn't. I have a boyfriend. You were flirting with me earlier. I was not. I have a boyfriend. His name is Maximilius. Okay, right. Let's that is. Let's have a long rest. Okay, everyone take a long rest. So do exclamation G space L R. Oh, I just did it in the app. Oh, okay. I don't know if it's going to, if you can do it here in Avray. Okay, sorry. No, no, it's fine. You didn't know. Exclamation. Uh, G space L R. Uh, and I totally already had a leather worker here in the city. I totally don't have to just make one up. <laughs> I keep, you know, keeps trying to say I'm I'm having great. <laughs> I don't really trust the children. Mm -hmm. I'm tired. Yeah. Can we not hear them? Hello? You yeah, can hear I can, us. I can hear you. Bonk, are you having okay. a rest? Or are you just staying up? I'm just staying up. I'm good. I am good, right? You check your health? 
Well, so I'll say I'll say after an hour, nothing happens. Like you're just you're left alone in the stables. The donkey kind of like a little bit, but that's about it. That was a good donkey. Thank you. He literally eat all. Yeah, my health's good. I'm good. Okay, you you're gonna stay awake. Yeah. Okay. Well, well a few a few more hours passed, uh, and the, all the all of you guys are fast asleep except from Maylor, uh, and uh, an, an orcish woman comes out holding this pot, and this pot is steaming and it smells beautiful. Um, the the food is ready. I have prepared oh. it for for your group. Oh, thanks. Uh, could you just leave it here? Oh. Yeah, that would be great. Of course, we have um, some cutlery and some bowls as well. Here you go. Okay, thanks. Please enjoy. Thank Wake you. Wake me up. Wake me up inside. Should Save I just it? wait? I feel like I will wake everybody else but Nilo. Because I want to, you know. You don't get back like at him. you don't like Nilo. I get it. I don't like Nilor. <laughs> Why does everyone hate me? I don't. <laughs> yeah, but you're not in the game. What do you mean? I'm everywhere. I, I was just in the game as an orcish woman. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you. <laughs> okay, I'll wake up anyway because I hear the commotion and I start eating my stew. Well... <laughs> Well, I mean, she does kind of... Actually, make a... Mm, tell you what, I'll roll. I'll roll for it. That's a, that's a nat 20. Nilo, you do wake up. Nilo, actually, Nilo, you wake up as soon as the food kind of... As soon as the orcish woman leaves, the smell of the food just wakes you up. Oh, am I really? Is that stupid? Uh, yeah, Maylor. Maylor, Maylor, Maylor wakes all of you up. Okay. Let's eat, you guys. Dude. Like you're gonna fall asleep. <laughs> oh, there's another blanket missing it. Oh. I mean, if you if you need it, I think you could share one. Yeah. Okay. Cool. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, you do you do have to continue your rest though. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what we okay, I'll go back to sleep. <laughs> okay, you guys eat. It's beautiful. This this dire wolf stew. It's absolutely fantastic. A little bit of herbs in there. Uh, I'm an awful cook, so I'm not gonna over, overdo it. But the stew was was first seared on the outside. Okay, well that's a bit too much. And then it was put in the pot for over two hours with carrots, parsnips onions and it's brought to a boil and then slowly slow cooked into all the meat dissolves in your mouth anyway it tasted really nice and you guys head back to sleep to get the rest of your rest that's such a weird sentence something that's similar to rosemary uh maylor do you stay awake again what um i sleep okay can you take a short can you take a short oh, rest oh. for me? Okay. <clears throat> because in the next four hours of you guys sleeping, which you only get to sleep for four hours, Maylor, which is a short rest, the rest of the guys wake up. So if you do, if you come into Discord and type exclamation G space S R. Yeah. Take a short rest, getting a spell slot back. Uh, you you, you also do. Well, she can't because she needs an extra four hours, unless you guys are willing to carry her. So, okay, so um, we'll role play it, right? So you guys wake up and you see Maylor is still fast asleep. Why did she not? Why did you not sleep when we were all sleeping? <laughs> You're talking to an unconscious body. I keep oh. her on the we leg. And I'm like, I wake her up. Why? Why are you still sleeping? Why didn't you sleep when we were sleeping? <laughs> we talked just before um, I fell asleep, and we didn't trust the children, so she stayed awake. 
Okay. Why do you trust children? <laughs> you don't know. Why that, would oh, you? I don't, I'm not gonna speak. Right. But okay, yeah. I'm, well, you do Why get you? you do get kicked in the leg, which does kind of stir you. Mhm. Mm well, what was that again about me not sleeping before? Why didn't you sleep when we were sleeping? Because you don't know whether the children are children. <laughs> Look at your spell. Okay. okay, I I I I propose that we wait for her. Like we wait for her to complete her rest. Yeah, Alright. I'm gonna go and see if the orc wants anything any help around the farm. And I'm just gonna take in the scenery and walk around the farm. I'm good with, you know, not resting that that well, so it's fine. No, no, you need to rest because your hit points are low and then you'll be a liability <laughs> for us in a combat. Hit, hit points? Oh. What are hit points? You know, when someone hits you. <laughs> you look um, so what are hit aware. points? Oh, no. We don't have hit points. <laughs> also, what? we don't know what hit points are, right? Yeah, of course. So, um, no. like, if you're hurt, <laughs> you're injured, I don't want to be a liability when we go into another combat. Go. So just take your rest. Should I take another short rest? No, no, no. Complete a long rest. Okay. As you sleep for another four hours. Right, so... Yeah, so I reveal you take in the scenery, right? Yeah, walk around the farm. <clears throat> so we'll do that first. Um, the farm is surrounded by a forest. It's not an intensely deep and dense forest, but, uh, you know, it is, it is a bountiful place. Um... The the wheat seems to uh, kind of almost be finished growing. They're getting ready to harvest, it looks like. Um, and as the day kind of goes on, it's now coming into the evening, uh, like late evening. Um, uh, all of the families kind of gather towards one area uh, and kneel or... You see this as well, because you want to go and ask. Uh, and the families will sit by a fire. There's probably... There, I think there's... Yeah, there's three families. Uh, a family of orcs, a family of humans, and a uh, family of dwarves. Mm. And they're all sat around this campfire uh, as it as kind of the sun goes down. Ah, uh, hey guys, can I join you? The, the orc pipes up. Of course, everyone. This is uh, one of the adventurers who helped save us from our plight. The name's Nilor. Uh, the children start cheering. Nilo, 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 Nilo. You join in. <laughs> this fucking idiot, am I right? Ah. <laughs> uh. I have a sit down by the fire. Or ask Come if got any, sit. If they've got any ale or anything. Of course, give this man a drink. Uh, ah, lovely. One of the dwarves hands you a flask of ale. Thank you. Or a flagon of ale. No. Thank you. Um, I don't want to sit with you. them. I just go keep walking. Like I don't want to socialize. Yeah, you watch. The dwarves. You can't tell if they're male or female. So. You watch from afar. Well, no, you you can. I mean. I like to say dwarven women have beards, but they don't. They do. <laughs> no, they don't. Okay. I don't want to socialize. No, that's I, fine. I just I'm keep... not saying. Yeah, yeah. You're just keeping an eye. I'm just saying you can see this. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's just Nilo. Uh, okay. The the orc the orc said this is one of the adventurers because you're not here. I say to the um. The part, the families. Would you? Would you? Do, I'm a. Fo I'm a folk. Um, I'm, a, I'm a bard. Would you guys like to have some nice music? Oh, of course. Play us some tunes. Okay, so I roll. I roll my eyes and walk away. <clears throat> if you can, if you can play me a song that I like, I will forego a performance role. <laughs> so this, this is this is a song from Tales of Old from. It's very old. It's been around for ages, and it's been in my family for years. The children will get to the edge of their song. seats. It's an old elf song. Um, 
back in back when us elves were tortured and kept behind walls. Here we go. Um, I've forgotten how the chords go. <laughs> Today is gonna be the day that you're gonna throw it back to you. Right now, we should have somehow realized what we gotta do. I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now. Oh, I know this one. Oh, do you? I'll, I'll yes, sing keep, along then. keep playing. I will. I will. Bag beat, the word is on the street that the, and the fire, fire in your heart, heart is out. Is out. <laughs> I'm sure you've heard it all before, but you, but never, you never really had it down. Sing it! I don't, I don't believe, believe that anybody feels the way, way I, I do, do about, about you. you now. Hey, 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 everyone. Everyone claps. <laughs> ah, that is a good, that is a good song. Ah, the children all, yay! Start clapping. Even the dwarves kind of like, start like nodding their head. The name of that song is Wonderful. So you sip, <laughs> sip on the fire and you chat with them while Mabel kind of gets the rest of her rest, yeah? Okay, is she off now? Yeah, yeah. The The next four hours kind of go uneventfully. And Maylor does awake. Uh, it is now kind of pitch black. It's night time. Uh, the two moons hang high in the sky. Uh, and there's a, there's a bit of a chill. There's a bit of a chill on the air. Did you say two moons? Two two moons, yeah. Didn't you know the moons in the sky? Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, literally, they've been staring at us the entire time. No. I've actually never looked up at the sky before. Me either. <laughs> Hold on. Yep. There are two. What there are is two going moons. on there? <laughs> there are two moons. What are the coffee shit? Oh, those are stars. I feel like giving them an asthma. I should know about this. <laughs> and there's two moons. Aren't you guys like birds? <laughs> I, I'm a fucking bird. What is that dishonor? <laughs> and birds look at the ground when we fly. Not that I fly, but <laughs> a collective V, if you will. Right. Let's let's head back in, turn in this quest. Are you guys ready? Yes. Yeah. yeah. First official. Back, but, you know. <clears throat> okay. On the way back, um, it's about two days travel, and uh, when you come to kind of you travel all night, then all day, then decide to camp, and you get maybe half a day just under a day's travel left when you when you make camp uh, and you decide to sleep. Uh, I need everyone except from Vale to deafen, please. And I will type when you can come back. Okay, Vale. <laughs> <coughs> You're asleep. Okay. It's dark. Mm-hmm. You feel weightless like you're drifting Ooh. around in the ocean but mm -hmm. you can breathe you feel okay. calm and your senses are hyperly active when off in the distance you can hear the ticking of a clock tick 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 and a small, white, almost golden uh, glow start to appear. And as he gets just big enough for you to 
fully see this glow. Please, deaf, please, deafen. What? <laughs> <laughs> that was that was ha that was Harry. <laughs> He's messing around in the chat. God damn it. Just as you can see kind of this glow get bigger, you can see that it matches almost perfectly to the symbol on your shield. Mm. And as you as this recollection comes to you, as you recognize this, you hear a voice seemingly from nowhere except mm -hmm. inside of your head. My child. Fucking hell, what was that? We are in great need of your assistance. Okay, who are you, sir? There is time for that later. I just need to warn you. I come from a time that is yet to happen. Okay. This is very weird. Those of great corruption have plagued the earth. You and your party must seek out the cult of corruption and stop them by whatever means. Okay, how do I do that? Do you but... remember the cave in yes. which you found the altar? Oh, yeah. Many more of those reside in the lands. It is up to you, my chosen one, to find them and destroy them. Oh, damn, I'm the chosen one. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, where? How do I find these? Like, how do I know which direction to go in? They will come across you when the time is ready. Mm -hmm. My powers are fleeting. Oh, damn. Okay. This this stone that I am in is stopping me from using my full power. I must go. Why are you in a stone, sir? Don't and go. <laughs> the light goes back down to a dim as okay. your senses start to also become dim. And mm -hmm. all of a sudden, you wake up in the daytime. Okay. I do not talk about this with the other people. <clears throat> That's fine. Just now. That's fine. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> fine. <laughs> we like this one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hello, children. <laughs> Hello, mother. Just wait for mm -hmm. Harry to come back. He's deafened. Oh, I so deafened? Wild. What's happening? Oh, wait, we're waiting. You're waiting for Harry. We're waiting for Harry. Oh, uh, and while we do, did you guys know that in France, the croissant is often filled with a jam and jelly at home? In yeah. some countries, like Italy, croissants are sold in bakeries, already filled. In Germany, Nutella is the most popular filling. Hon, hon, mm. hon. Okay, <laughs> croissant. Nobody yeah. cares. Croissants, right? Yeah, oh, but I really so like um, croissant sandwiches, like oh, pecky yeah. ham and mm. lettuce. You put, One of you put <laughs> croissants... Oh, wow, we actually joined. No, get out of me! <laughs> get out of me! <laughs> How did you? How did you jump? The how did you do that? <laughs> how did you come to our world? Oh, uh, Harry, you're back, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm back. Okay. Oh, we were just. Who ever said they did? They, they didn't care. Get out. <laughs> get get I back on the Twitch. Stay on the stay on Twitch. Chris, stay yeah. on Twitch. You can't skip applications. <laughs> okay. And social media platforms. You guys, <laughs> you guys, wake up in your camp and continue on. Your journey mm -hmm. towards the town. Cool. I mean, I'm down here. Are we there? So you make it to the town of Megaton, just as, just as kind of midday peaks. Uh, and you um, see, 
You see an all too familiar guard outside. Huh. Huh. Um, oh, and God. and Ethan, uh, well, I'm sorry, and Nunya kind of like gives him a look and does that does that thing where, like you know, you know when like you do the like head forward like like coming in like. He does. <laughs> he he does that. The guard. The guard kind of like drops his helmet a little bit, and Nanya kind of goes. <laughs> <laughs> What's the guard's name? You don't know. I'm, I mean, I live here. Uh, <laughs> I mean, there's so many people you don't know. This guy. You rarely ever leave the the town. I'm just getting it set up. Carry on. He just he he's too busy staring at the Goliath like <laughs> like sword like like hair like clutched in his grass still in his sheath but like just waiting <laughs> as you guys walk past. Okay, you're in the town of Megaton. You go straight All to right. the Adventurers Guild. Okay, guys. Um. Oh yeah, Adventurers Guild, and then I need I need to go and visit my mum. Oh man. Okay. So let's go um, submit the ears or whatever we had to. The five ears. Okay. You let's come go. down into kind of the cent center area and you see the mm -hmm. Adventurers Guild off to the left, the kind of small wooded uh, mm -hmm. st st straw structure. Don't know why mm -hmm. that was so hard to say. Uh, you walk in and uh, the tiefling is there, and as you walk in... Ah, yes! How are you? I hope everything went well. Well, yeah, I guess so. We're all alive. Yeah. Uh, so... Was Matt is... Uh, we have the ears. Yeah, we got some Where ears. Where's the money? Of ears. Ah, very good, very good. Please, how many ears have you got? Please pass them over. Okay, uh, so... How many years? Twelve. Okay, so hold on. How many? How many does Frumpel hand over? I can't. Can't pass twelve. <laughs> that doesn't answer my question. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I think it was twenty. You you certainly didn't have twenty years. I want people to do. What is your pass over? What your character has, please. I have sixteen years. Ah. Okay, so um, that's uh, thirty. Wait, twelve. Mm. Hold on, uh, thirty-two pieces of gold. I don't know why that was so Ooh. difficult for me to do. I chuck Let over. I chuck over my six ears. Ah, there's I'm hanging onto the dire wolves. There's twelve gold pieces for you. Ah, my <laughs> tea. My Arocra friend, how are you doing? Oh, I need to quickly run. I'll be two seconds. Um, I don't know how many ears I have. Can you count for me? <clears throat> well, I don't fucking know. <laughs> okay. I don't remember. I think it was twenty. You sh you definitely you don't have twenty. Don't have twenty. You can't have twenty. Why not? Because that's not <laughs> enough. There weren't enough. I spoke for you to have twenty. Mr. Mr. DM man, Mr. DM man, I spawned in my own ears. Why can't I use them? I have sixteen. Then did you put any of them down? You just put wolf rates in your wolf. You just put wolf R A T E, and you only have one. <laughs> but you managed to write you managed to write the bread you got from his mum as well as the dwarven femur that you picked up <clears throat> but you can't keep track of the ears what actually mattered unfortunately if you'd got nothing to pull over you don't get paid no, okay, fine I have at least I'm pretty sure I have at least 16 you right Right. Okay. Let, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you exactly how many wolves there were. Right. So how many have we done already? We've done eight, and then another three. So that's eleven wolves. You guys killed. Deep <laughs> bears. Okay. I think I think uh, Nobi's character and Alcohol's oh. character had two each. 
I, as far as I, I, I think I had three. There are, <clears throat> there were only about eighteen wolves that you killed, mm -hmm. right? And nine of them have already been spoken for. Yeah, and I think Novi definitely had to. Uh, Alcohol's yeah. character had to. <laughs> Oh my they, god, they I may both, have been quadrupling in my head. They both, you know what, for your... How can I not be mean? <laughs> for Please your... Please be mean. Lewis, wait. I've been, I've been counting the wolves and then quadrupling them in my head instead of doubling. Why? <laughs> How? Have I don't know. That. So no, so you have so you have eight. So you had four four pairs of ears. Yes. Right. Okay, fine. Here's sixteen god pieces. As well as as well as a further fifteen gold pieces for all of you. Yeah. Nice. 16 so, gold pieces each? So oh, everyone was... gets 15 each. Okay. 15, okay. One five. 15. One five. On, on top of uh, the gold you cast in for the ears, yeah. Oh shit, how much did I cast in for the ears? Oh my. Minute? How many ears did you have? You had About six 14. ears. Six, six ears, yes. Times that by two. Okay. 12. 12. <laughs> 20, uh, 27. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, total, total, yeah. Would, would oh, these direwolf ears give me any more cash? Oh, there was a direwolf in there. I'll, uh, I'll pay you double. How no, about... Ask for more. How about triple? Because that thing, that thing was pretty bulky. Make a, make a persuasion. Um, Why did you, Shana, roll, roll? Did you roll something, Shana? Accidentally. <laughs> P R S E. Auto correct help. Oh great. You know what? I, I like the cut of your jib. Double. How about triple? Uh, double. Double point you... five. Uh, I will pay you the same rate as the wolf is. Shall we stick with double? Mm, I think I'm gonna pay you one. Uh, I hey, think uh, I'm gonna pay hi. you one and a half. Wait, wait, wait. I'm. G I take him to the side, and I'm like, uh, if I like convince him to pay you more, her, do her you agree to split female, it? Tifa. Oh, Harry's character is a female. No, no. Oh, no. Oh, sorry. Convince, convince. When you said oh. you said convince him, I oh, convince her. Tifa. If I convince sorry. her to pay you more, do you agree to split it with me? Um, split in half. Let me think. Because, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. like, I got like a plus yeah. five on persuasion. Yeah, why not? <laughs> yeah. I got a plus wow. five. Okay. I got a plus five to persuasion. You're like, you're like, what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> I am, I am an Asmar paladin. Okay, I'm good at persuasion. Yeah, I get a plus just five say, as well. Did you just saw say what you're, I got? you're very persuasive. <laughs> I'm very persuasive, man. I can be if very I, intimidating. If I, if I was persuasive. to put, if I was to put a number on how persuasive I am, I'd say about a five. Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> 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 so I just make a persuasion check. Yeah. <clears throat> Do you see that? Do you what see do you, that? What do you say? Uh, how about you make it four times? Mm. I'll go. I'll go two and a half. Uh, okay, come on, okay, four okay. times. Look, look, two and a half, that's, come on, I got 14 of persuasion. This, I'll go two and a half. This. The, thing, the mm. thing about these dire wolves mm -hmm. is, you yeah. know... Oh, wait, do I not... Is, do I is, not, he, is he back involved? This, this wait, wait, wait. dire wolf was is he, nice. is he back involved? Yes. The, the, this, this DM, wolf shut up. Had, DM. Had, <laughs> yes, very <well. laughs> Can Harry not assist me in the persuasion check? No, because he already tried his. Oh, okay. Never and mind. I, otherwise, <laughs> otherwise, we're going to be here throwing dice until you get what you want. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to do that. Okay, fine. <laughs> 2.5, here you go. Okay, so you hand over two dire wolves and you get uh, five gold pieces for each, which is ten gold pieces. In total. Right, and in total, so I, yeah, thank you. 
I appreciate that. <laughs> so I have 22 in total. Uh, the teeth ring uh, also says, also, um, if, just in case you forgot her name. Oh, that's the wrong page. What? Uh, it's it's Bal Balmazon. Uh, Bal Balmazon says, um, uh, st stick around in town for a while. We don't have any quests at the moment, but shortly we will. Okay. Where do I find my gold? <laughs> in your inventory. In um... In, in, yeah, in equipment, oh, yeah, right at the top, it. currency. So, Manage equipment. I, don't know, I don't know about you guys, but I think I'm going to go hit the tavern. Okay, I'm going to stop by my mum's quickly. Um, You're all welcome to stay there. No, thank what? you. I had that grieving moment. I can't handle any more crying. <laughs> I, I, I go, I go ar for a walk around the town to check out what's what. The new town. Okay, Vale's going for a walk. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm going to the tavern. Do you want to come below? Wait, how yes. do we how do we contact each other Maybe. if we need to? Me and my mom. Um. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, before before anything happens, um, you walk outside and you see a uh like a a boy in common clothing and he's putting up. He's like nailing a piece of paper into uh, uh, the bulletin board outside of the Adventurers Guild. What's that sound? Sorry? There was a tapping sound? Yeah, that. Yeah, that's Veil. Vale. Don't know what Veil's vale doing. Oh, sorry. Let me turn on Breathing. my expression. <laughs> okay. I, w I just tapped on my laptop. Yeah, so the uh, so this 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 young boy is nailing a piece of paper into the uh, bounty board outside. Ooh, let's go and have a look. Okay, he's, he he kind of runs off with more bits of paper in his uh, like messenger bag, uh, and as you look, you see a wanted poster, or no, sorry, a gone missing poster, um, and. It says, uh, the, the princess has run away, uh, a thousand gold pieces to anyone with information as to her whereabouts. And there's a picture. And all of you recognize the picture. And <laughs> the, uh, the, <laughs> the picture is of Novi's character. Uh -huh. Oh, Groot. Oh my god, that's you. I turned around. Um, I turn around and I'm like, what the uh, fuck, girl? You're a prince? Um, I really thought I'd have more time. <laughs> Please don't tell oh, anyone. Oh. Okay, okay, but do you, do you want to tell us why you ran away? Or what's up? Are you safe? Well, Is yeah, or yeah. I mean, Dad, you know the king. He's he's a nice guy, you know. He he does well by all the subjects and stuff. But I just, I I just want to be an adventurer, you know. I just like being out on the roads. I just being cooped up, being all the doing all the princess stuff. Just I didn't really like did it. You, she starts like you, picking at her fingers, looking down. Did you did you try and talk to your father? Yeah, yeah, quite a few times. I tried to talk to mum as well, but she just, they just, they've always told me, you have to do your responsibilities, your royalty, you know. <laughs> okay, we, we, we'll keep your secret, your secret safe with us. Oh, right, Nilor? <laughs> Nilor's just staring at the thousand gold for information part, just like, <laughs> just like, uh... <laughs> I've I've got to follow the. Mm. Come on. Let me ask a question. Is it against the law you're missing? Well, no. I mean, there's no law that that keeps me, keeps like that would be, that would be quite awful of of my father to say, you know, to make a law. Yeah, just... it's not dictatorship. Come on. Are you allowed to run away? 
Well, I mean, he he would rather that I stick to my duties as a princess. Ah, it's all right then. What kind of stupid question is that? Are you allowed to run away? What kind of stupid question is that? On you. <laughs> uh, sorry. Your father's the fucking king. You're, you just asked her, are you allowed to run away? Who is allowed to run away? <laughs> what? I'm allowed to run away. I can run away if I want. <laughs> yeah, so yeah but see. you're not a... Hey, 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 let's go and ask my mum if I'm allowed to run away. Come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. You think mum is really going to say that he's not I, a princess? I start, I start to walk off to my mum's house and say, come on, let's go and ask my mum if I can run away. Uh, is there food oh. in your plate, at your plate? Is... <laughs> Do you know what? Um, I think if we catch in on turning group in, I think we should do that. Like, I respect your journey to find yourself, Groot, but, you know, my name. Yeah. Wait, wait, you're gonna, you're, you're not gonna turn name? me in, are you? Um, did you not hear any of that? <laughs> yeah, she's just in disbelief and can't believe that you're gonna no, turn her in. come on. What is your character's name? I'm sorry. Rumpel, come on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. No, he's not. He's playing yeah, the character. No, yeah, no, yeah, I I heard. I heard. I just can't believe that. Um, oh, come on. Don't, don't and do she it. runs. Shit, she runs for it. Oh, oh no. Fuck. no after Why her. would you do that, Frumpel? <laughs> you, you run, you you run after her. her. Yeah, I run after her. It would have been fine. Wait a minute, can't she just, like, disappear and reappear somewhere? Well, as soon as you turn the corner, she's gone. Oh, there you go. <laughs> okay, thank you for doing that, Rumpel. There we go, lost the money. <laughs> um, and so we got the money. Uh, you, also, we you also notice that you're missing a rather tall party member. Oh, where is, no. where is the Goliath, by the way? Lewis, no, we don't. We don't notice. <laughs> the Goliath, the Goliath has just disappeared. Yeah, but we don't notice. And that's good writing, man. That's right. good writing. He just uh, disappeared. Mm, but you don't know no, where I... he's gone, do you? I haven't okay. been yeah, but... recently. Where is the Goliath? Yeah. I don't care. <laughs> where did the Goliath go? Damn. Oh, Where's Mario gone? I haven't been insulted recently. Oh. Hey, get back here! And you look over and over, oh, kind of on the other side. <laughs> you can see the Goliath got a guard in a headlock and he's just punching another guard. Dude, just stop. Like, what are you doing? You guys can't tell me what to do. All right. Well, I guess he's under arrest. Let's leave him. All right. Oh, and he gets, he gets, he gets dogpiled by like five dudes and like some of them wow. like stab him. Like, ah! I, but, ah! I, I, officers. Since we technically brought him into town, do you think we can get a payout for turning him in? Yeah. You did nothing of the sort. Are you trying to... This seems like extortion of some kind. <laughs> you're trying to... Hold on. You're trying to push a guard for money by doing nothing just because... Wait, did you say that you know this man? I don't know. No, we, know we don't know that man. Nope. You brought him into the... I would like you to come down to the station for questioning, if that is okay. Oh, come on. He went rogue. Not our fault. We just heard him that's, saying, nope, that's, you can't tell that's, me what I, to do. No, I, that is fine. You're not, you're not being detained. You're not under arrest. Um, but if you did bring a dangerous person into the town, we would like to have some questions. All right. Fine, whatever. Let's go. Cool. I'm Very not well. in war. I'm not going... No, you wait. That was yeah, okay. <laughs> so Baylor just kind of stands there, he's just like, no, I don't give a shit. <laughs> and the the Goliath is put in shackles, and a uh uh like a mouth guard is put around his face, so he can't say anything. As like six dudes are trying to drag him off, he's just like thrashing. <laughs> Harry, you're taking with my mouth guard on. <laughs> you guys are taken to the center of this uh, kind of like circle bit in the middle. And uh, I don't know if you remember, but the first time you came to Megaton, I said you can see four different towering buildings in the center. 
Yeah. These are these four different buildings. So from where you warp, uh, as you come into the middle, on your right is a manor. It's a f- tall four-story building made of fine silver and stone. Uh, and at the top lies an observatory uh, like made of glass. Uh, on the on the far side of that is a sanctuary, a three story building made of metal and wood, uh, and it's got these very fine engravings uh, and a picture of a dwarf hitting his hammer on an anvil. Uh, next to that is so it's kind of in this cross section uh, is a vineyard. It's this uh, yeah. it's this uh, four story building with like hanging gardens and like lots of open bits and like. Uh, vines dangling down uh, and finally the building that you're being taken into is a five story castle made from stone uh, this glorious piece of architecture stands above the other buildings in this town uh, and it was the was the prominent building that you could see when entering um, <laughs> and as you guys walk in uh, the Goliath gets dragged off through a room and you guys are taken through a door where you come to kind of, kind of like this reception area and the guard who asks you to come here goes behind the desk, pulls up a parchment of paper, an inkwell and goes, so um, what is the assailant's name? Um, I think his full name is none of your business. That is, that is not funny. <laughs> it is kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> please if you are going to obstruct justice then that will become an issue please tell us the assailant's name he did not tell us the that name. Is... he told us that his name was none of your, none of your business That's hey, we don't even know his us. name why are we here because of him come on he can so only report to you what we know you can't harass us the only because... reason the only reason that you are here is because you said you brought in a dangerous person to the city had you not uh, yeah. ex- explained that information it. you wouldn't be here right now yeah uh, can i can i go i i literally just tagged along with these guys on adventure and this guy's been nothing but horrible to me is this uh, true Really? Yeah, I'm. I'm a. No. I'm a, actually a resident. I'm not here. talking to I you. Have the dialogue. Okay. Really? Is that what I get in return for helping you with the dialogue and get more money for the ears? They man? seem like Seriously? they know you. you. I think you'll okay, stay. Okay, we are adventurers. Can I show you my ID? Ah, yes. Ah, there we go. Yes, some ID. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yes, we 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 are in collaboration. <laughs> we work in collaboration with the adventurers ah. guild. We just saved your town with a bun- from a bunch of wolves. I appreciate that. Okay, yeah. so uh, you wrote you wrote Black Veil on your card, didn't you? Yeah. Black Veil. Okay. Um, uh, you Tiefling, please pass over your identification. And he stares straight at you, Frumple. Any day now. Sorry, I sat down the wrong person. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. That's my bad. It's okay. I'll go back. I'll go back. Uh, so the guard says, Tiefling, please pass your identification, which is your uh, adventuring card. Oh, okay. Um, in that case, I will still proceed to, you know, be in silence. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and you pass over the card. You wrote Frumple Stiltskin not down on it, didn't you? Frumple Stiltskin, Aurora, um, Falconson. Uh, Mrs. Falconson. <laughs> Okay, uh, and you, son. Please pass over your identification. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Okay. Uh, Nilor Pax. Of the pa- of the Pax family. Mm-hmm, yeah. It is, sh- it is a shame what happened to your father. News has yeah, spread. I... News has spread. We, we now know what happened to him. Yeah, we, we don't yeah. talk about that, but that was also us, by the way. <clears throat> We're kind of amazing, so just let us go. I That's see. I, I you are not place. you are not here under detainment or anything of the such. We would just like to ask some so, questions about the Goliath. You can keep the Goliath. Uh, just let us go. All I would like to know is a little bit about this Goliath. Anything we that you do know? We okay. just like came across him, like ran to him during another adventure with some goblins and stuff. <clears throat> 
Yeah, um, yeah we don't really know him. We don't really know each other. So, um, is there any yeah. close family? We no. literally know nothing about this dude. Oh, so. a really, really quick question. Yes. Um, that um, Goliath had something on his possession that belonged to my family. <laughs> oh, I see. Oh, he stole. Oh, Why was this not reported? Um, it was given to him, but considering he's now a criminal, I, I'm, I'm on from saying for my fam, for, on behalf of my family, I don't think he deserves it. If the object was given to him, it is uh, unrightful for us to steal items from him. So I'm afraid I cannot do that. You may file a, uh, an inventory, uh, receipt, uh, and it will be passed through the courts. Uh, and in about two to three weeks, you will uh, get an answer. Okay, where do I go for that? Uh, right here. Uh, we'll, we will do that after. So you say you don't okay, know okay. anything about the Goliath. You picked him up from the streets, more or less, uh, and he adventured with you, but was mean to you. Yes. I see. Thank you very much for that. And might I offer yeah. some advice? Yeah. Yeah. Um, do not pick up random strangers you meet on the on the streets. I know, it's surrounded by goblins. You don't have any other choice. <clears throat> is it the friend you haven't met yet? And look where that has gotten you today. Okay, thank you for the advice and your cooperation, sir. We're just going to head out now. That is fine. Uh, real quickly, Nilo, uh, I will um, hand you a slip. This is an inventory receipt. Please fill it out. And it's just boring stuff. Okay. In about two to three weeks, this will be processed and we will uh, send the information to your homestead. Okay, lovely. Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, we appreciate your cooperation. Good day. All right, and you leave. Uh, I don't leave. Isn't isn't there like lever worker like in this little... House, like, they got <clears throat> uh, no, it's not in this house. This fort, oh, okay. this fort, fort yeah. that you're in, is part of the Sam. No, not the Sam. This is the Jack Manifold family. Okay, aren't they the ones that do the lever working? They, they are, but you're in, you're in the fort. Oh, so they have a, you know, a little other bit. Okay, cool. So yeah, so from what you know about the city, as well as there being four families, the city itself is divided into four sections. You live in uh, the Josh section. I'll actually send you guys a picture of the town of Megaton. Do, 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 do. Uh, we'll probably take a short break in a moment as well if you guys are down. Yeah, yeah. sure. I just want to... I've got lots of errands to run in Megaton. <laughs> Okay, is the okay? We're still with the officer right now, right? Uh, no, you're outside. But Harry would oh. like to go to the leather worker, and I'm just gonna send you a picture of. Oh, I go with town. him. That's half of mine. Okay, you're gonna tag along. Cool. I've, yeah. Let's, let's see how much we can fetch for this. Okay. Maybe we could, we could probably sell it to them untanned. So, Maylor, May did you did you go to the the tavern when they took the Goliath away? Maylor, did you go to the tavern with me? No, no, no. Yeah. no. When when uh, when when the Goliath got dragged away and you all got questioned, Maylor was like, "I ain't fucking going." Did you go to the tavern at that point? No. Yeah. No? Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Can you guys uh, hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. And then, and then Frumple, I assume you head to the tavern now. Yep. Okay. I have right, something so I want to look up. Frumple heads off towards the tavern, and you guys ask around a bit, find the leather worker, uh, and you come to this wooden shop. Uh, just behind, kind of not not right behind the fort, but on that circle street, uh, in that kind of area, 
Uh, you find a wooden building with uh, uh, a human man working outside, uh, kind of like stretching out some uh, cow skin for it to dry. <laughs> okay, cool. Ah, how are you doing there? Hey, how's it going? Um, just so closing just... up for the day. Oh, uh, do you have a second? But yeah, as soon as I'm finishing this, though, it's uh, closing hours. All oh, right, all right, all right. I go into my bag. So we were, um, you know, we were just done, just cleared a dungeon of wolves, uh, a cave of wolves. Sorry. Oh, well, that sounds um, dangerous. Um, and we've, we've come across a dire wolf. Do you have any idea how much their pelts can go? Oh, I can read this as monkey. A, di a dire wolf, you say? Yeah, wow. yeah. I don't think I've ever worked on a dire wolf pelt before. Well, if the right person buys it, we can probably make a nice rug from it. Okay, well, Get I've a... got a three by three foot square. Oh. I'm, not, I'm not very good at, you know. Okay, that would maybe make a nice handbag, perhaps. Yeah, and it's not tanned either. Ah, I see. Yeah. So what are you asking? Would you like me to tan it for you and you construct it? Or are I'm you offering to sell the pelts to asking us? Asking two things. How much would it be? To start, how much would it be to tan it? Well, we do the tanning. Um, for you to tan it yourself, you would have to buy a tanning bed. Those are okay. How much would it be for you pricey. to tan it? Uh, for me to just tan it. Yeah, uh, how much will it cost? Ten, ten silver pieces. Okay, and how much would it be to just to sell it once it's tanned? Do you reckon? I show him the untanned. Oh, that is that is a gorgeous piece of fur. Um. Yeah. Okay, so for for what? For me to buy the tanned? I'm, okay, two I'm questions. Tanned. Listen I'm to me. Tanned. Untanned. How much will you? Okay, first question: How much will you give us for the untanned? If we try to sell oh, I'll you, pay the you. Untanned. I'll pay you five gold pieces for that. That's it. Come on, you can do how better. Much, how much would it usually be worth on being tanned? Uh, you know, I could with no work done, I could probably upsell it for about seven gold. But there's really not a lot of people around here that buy just tanned, so I'd have to. Uh, work it probably into a bag, which I could probably sell for about ten gold. All right, all right, all right. Um, because I don't want to put you out of pocket. Shall we say seven gold? Uh, I'll meet you in the middle. Six. Make a persuasion check. Sure. With Harry's assistance. Okay, you get advantage on your roll. So make another one. Mm. Okay, seven. Oh uh, yeah, seven gold pieces. I roll it back up and chuck in this chunk. <laughs> he gets like a little bit of blood on his face, and he's like, he just kind of wipes it off. Big smirk on Wait, his face. I didn't say seven. I I persuaded this to eight. Come on. 19. I didn't hear eight. I didn't hear eight. Sorry. <laughs> uh, never mind. Right. Let's let's go off with seven. Yeah. Here's uh. Four. Well, he he pays three, you three. seven. Does, he pays you seven gold, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, okay. No. Now give me half. Okay. Here's three. Three. Uh, you know what? Because because it's an odd number, we <laughs> chuck this one on drinks later. Okay. Fine. Thanks, All right. Uh, you guys head to the tavern now. Oh, I want to. I want to quickly go over to um, the weaponsmith. It's if it's still open. Oh, okay, it's over the other side of. Do you ask the leather worker? Leather worker, what? Like, if the smithy is still open, or do you just go find yeah. out? Yeah, uh, I'll go and ask him. How long's the smith they're open for? Ah, well, they shut. Well, yeah, around now, same time as me, I'm afraid. And how long do I have until you shut? <laughs> well, I, I'm gonna uh, finish up with this cow skin and take this wolf skin inside and prep it for tanning. Okay. 
Uh, and I will be working after hours for that. I've got a decent amount of time. Can I make it? Ooh, maybe. You've got about five minutes. Uh, I'd say if you run fast enough, cut through the centre, you might be able to. How big is this town? This town's quite big. Alright, I'll go to the tavern, fuck it. <laughs> okay. Uh, I was hoping there was going to be like a, you run to it, get to the door, and the dude's like walking out, closing up, and you're like, please! But okay. Why right. do you need to go Will to the Will he serve me place? if I run across town? Well, it's, you gone to the tavern now, that would be metagaming. Oh, never mind. Alright. And that is where we're going to take a break. Ah. I want to do my, I want to complete my errands. Oh, yeah. Right, so <laughs> if we say, are you still streaming right now? Yeah, yeah. Uh, if we say <laughs> half uh, thirty-five twenty-two, or so. Hold on. So about forty minutes time, because then know the time's fucked for everyone. Yeah. So should we say forty minutes? Sure. I need. To, I need to eat and that. Yeah, I got food coming, so I need to eat as well. But, uh, but it's also getting kind of late, and uh, how much longer would we be playing after? How much longer would we be playing after? Uh, another hour and a half. Wait, so... It's we can, we can end it, we can end it here, if you like, this would be a good place to end it. <coughs> no, I want to play more. Did you not get the nap, Shina? I couldn't. Come on! No, I had a lot of shit to do and I wasn't able to. It's fine. If you wanna... Okay, it's alright. That's fine, yeah. So, same, should we say same time next week? Oh, I'm gonna forget to do yeah. errands. Okay, okay, we can finish up your errands and I wanna flirt in the tavern. Oh, okay. Alright, alright. We'll do a little bit. We'll do a little bit then. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Uh, viewers, you get you get a, a little extra fifteen minutes of role play, so enjoy. Okay. Well, the first to make it to the tavern is Maylor. The Goliath has just been dragged away. You decided, fuck that. I don't give a shit. I'm walking off. <clears throat> and you make your way to the eleven yeah. side. You make your way to the eleven-sided die. Okay. Uh, and you see, uh, as you walk in, you see Mary, the human woman, behind Ow. the uh, the desk, just like wiping down the desk, getting ready for a busy night. Hey, Mary. How you doing? Oh, that's such an awful voice. How you doing? <laughs> Is everything okay? I hope everything's all good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, everything's good. We we saved the town and everything. Oh, uh, I, I didn't realize the town was under danger. Oh yeah, don't worry about it. It's fine. Oh okay. <laughs> well, what can I get? Uh, for? Um, can I get can I get some some ale? Yeah, of course. Uh, that'll be two silver pieces. Okay, sure. And can I have something... Uh... No, wait. Ale is fine, yeah. Just ale. Okay. Uh, you see you see quite a few free tables. Uh, there's a table with a dwarf, a human, and an elf kind of all chatting. Uh, and then you see a kind of a lone orc just sat on his own, drinking, hunched over. Mm -hmm. But there's quite uh, a few can other I tables through. Okay, can I ap approach the one who's sitting alone? Uh, the orc. Yeah, the orc. As you walk over, just takes a sip from his, uh, like, I can't remember what they're fucking called, like a large mug. Just takes mm -hmm. a sip. Doesn't even look up at you. You you want some company? I'm so wrong for some reason. 
I suppose a little bit won't help her sit down. Okay. So, you've been here long? I'm just passing through. Oh. Passing through from where? Well, my party. I sat over there. We, uh... Oh. Been on the move for a little while. You said you, you're you part of a party? Yeah, that's right. So why aren't you sat over there with them? Well, <clears throat> I've suspended a few days in a road. <clears throat> it's nice to just drink in solace sometimes. They, they haven't been giving you trouble, have they? <laughs> They couldn't give me trouble if they tried. <sighs> hey, well, that's good to know. So where are you guys headed? Well, we just finished a quest. So we're just mm -hmm. waiting for the next quest to arrive. Okay. Uh, what did you fight? What did you end up fighting? Uh, we just went and killed some gnolls. Oh. I don't know if Where you've ever eat. seen a no. Um, I've seen a fair few, but I, I don't think I've seen a no before. Ah, do you know what a werewolf is? Yeah. Yeah, imagine that, but without the human. So just a wolf, then? Well, no, just a werewolf, but they don't revert back into a human form. They're creatures that look exactly like a werewolf. They're like they're like a hyena that can stick upright. So they were harder to kill. Yeah, they, them bosses are clever. Okay. So what what do you specialize in, in your in your party? Oh. Well, I'm a... <clears throat> I'm a bit of a connoisseur with a two-handed war axe, and he produces from underneath the table this massive two-headed war axe that he just kind of lifts with one arm. He oh. puts mm. it back underneath the table. Damn. Those look... Those look neat. <laughs> well, thank you. Uh... How long have you been in the adventuring game? Well, quite a while now. It's long enough to earn this. And he produces a card. And he puts it on the table. And he slides it over to you. Mm -hmm. You recognise it, but it is different. This is an Adventurer's Guild card. However, his is red and orange, whereas yours is kind of like a grey. Um... And I just need to get up the adventuring guild stuff. Oh my god, I know what's gonna happen. Yeah, so it still has five <laughs> slots, uh, but four of them are filled in. Oh. We're uh we're pretty close to reaching the next rank. Oh, so uh Wait, I, we just start. Our party just started, so we have like a grey card, and I pick it up and slide it over to them. To him. Ah! Oh, by the way, I totally forgot to mention this. All of you got another stamp for completing that quest. You have three stamps now. I totally forgot that. Yay! Yay! Oh, I see cadets. Well, it's always good to have more adventurers in the game. Yeah. So what 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 rank are these? We're flame rank. We, oh. uh, to put it into context, uh, we've done twenty nine jobs. Wow, that's impressive. Why? Thank you. We're the most revered uh, group of adventurers. <clears throat> In this entire region. 
Oh, that's cool. That's cool. That's your group over there, right? Yeah. I'm to know what to do with some people. Yeah. You, do you see the elf? You yeah. Do you see the elf? Yeah. He's a, he's a cleric, and uh, he worships the god of order. And so he decided that we should be called the Chosen. <laughs> Clever. Uh, it's a bunch of hearsay, I say. Mm. So who do you worship? I don't worship anyone. Ain't a god's been seen in these lands ever since... <laughs> well, fuck, I don't know. <laughs> I hear that. You know, you hear tell that there was a great war that happened, all gods got trapped in stones, but it's sort of a bunch of hogwash, if you ask me. Mm, sounds like it, but with all great tales, there is a little bit of truth in them. Yeah, I'm sure there was a great beast that got killed by a rock or some shit. <laughs> Probably mortalized now. Yeah, exactly. That's where all that shit comes from, isn't it? Some, some bard or poet spreading stories. Those stories get turned into books. Those books get worshipped or some shit. I don't fucking know. Yeah, fucking bards. <laughs> So, where's your party? Oh, uh... I don't fucking know. There were, um... One of them was supposed to accompany me here, but, uh, they decided to help out one of our party members, um, who is getting arrested. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> oh, that poor sack. Oh, he's going to be branded, that's oh, for sure. Oh, sorry for them. <laughs> anyway, like, uh, yeah, they will be here in a while, I'm guessing. But also, we, we picked up a bard as well along the way. Oh, well, we don't have a bard in our party. It's, uh, we got a fighter, got that cleric, and then we got a ranger. Oh. Ooh. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, I'm a barbarian myself. Ah, uh, makes sense. I, li I like your weapons. Why, thank you. And, uh, what are you? Oh, I'm a ranger myself. Uh, I should have guessed that by the bow. <laughs> nah, it's cool. It's cool. Oh. It's cool. Oh, yeah. I don't suppose you've seen any of this. And he produces a piece of paper, and it's the uh, missing persons poster for uh, Novi's character. Don't suppose uh, you've seen anything about this at all. Funny you should ask that. Um, <laughs> oh? Uh, we, we might have seen. Uh, she was around this area. Um, uh, probably like five minutes ago or something. You, that's, you're joking. No, I'm not. I, I'm not. <laughs> he immediately stands up at the table. Oi, right, boys, they sit down to the offices. The elf goes, and what could you possibly have that would make us sit up from this table? How about the princess's location? The dwarf stands up. Hey, right, let's fucking go. <laughs> And they all, <laughs> they all like, rush out the door. And York says, all right, thank you for this. If we get paid, I'll come down here and I'll buy you a drink. Oh, thank you very much. I would appreciate that. The dwarf is, like, tugging on him, like, come on, let's go. All right, I'm coming. See you later. See ya. And I leave. Uh, Frog pool, you kind of round yes. the corner towards the tavern and you see this, like, these ragtag group of people just rushing, and they're rushing so fast that the elf actually, like, palms your shoulder out of the way. <clears throat> Please move, we have important business to attend. And he kind of flashes a, a red and orange adventurer's card, almost like, like some kind of prideful git that he probably is, and he's like, Please move, 
<clears throat> shoves you out of the way. And as, as they go past, you see this like, quite large orc carrying this two-headed axe. He's like, oh, I'm so sorry about that. It's a bit of a cunt, that one. And he just like carries on. <clears throat> so you come up. <laughs> you come up to the tavern, uh, open it, and Maylor is sat alone uh, in... Like the, there's no one else in besides from uh, Mary, the human woman, sat behind the desk. Um, hi. Uh, do you know where I can find Maximilius? <laughs> oh, the oh, oh! I haven't seen him for well, a few days. Uh, since the last time oh, you were yeah. here, actually. So he doesn't come here often. Well, he's a bit of a busy man. Okay. Busy with what? <laughs> um, I'm not really sure. I know that he works up in the vineyard, but that's about it. Yeah, okay. Do you know where I can find this barnyard? <clears throat> a, a vineyard, my love. My, uh, vineyard. Uh, I'm sure that's how you pronounce it where you're from. <laughs> oh my god um yes sure um yeah where, do you know where about that is and do you know if I can score some um winner there <laughs> <laughs> well they, they do what? a really what? they do a really great vine wine um, all right, all right. Uh, I can, uh, I can uh, sell, I can sell you some here. We, we get supplied by them. Oh my god, fine. I must warn you, it is of the expensive Harry's taste. Harry's recipe. <laughs> can Wait, you make did you store? Wait, who? Harry. Harry's harassing me. How? <laughs> He's sending me endless angry emojis. <laughs> it's good. It's because you're flirting with someone other than him. <laughs> he doesn't care that it's a video game. He doesn't care. Not a video game. It's a not... fucking tabletop. <laughs> I know what I said. <laughs> Make him stop. He ain't gonna listen to me. <sighs> Harry. God. Harry, stop. No. See? What? <laughs> it sounded like he said no with the heart. <laughs> <laughs> it did. Anyway. Why? Oh. Anyway. Oh my god. Fine. Give me give me some wine to go. Oh, uh, that'll be five gold, please. Alright. That is fucking expensive. You're damn straight it is. <laughs> I mean, I've got to try the product first, right? Okay, so she hands you a, a blue bottle, and it's the whole bottle, full, still corked, of uh, <laughs> Lewis's Vine Wine, uh, with a picture of, like, a thorned vine in, like, an S shape for the S of Lewis. Lewis's Wine Wine? Vine Wine. Oh, okay. Vine. Vine. I don't even have to make it a Yeah, but anyway, he, he's pronouncing the I W know, as well. I know. Uh, we don't have like a distinction between the W and um, the, v. the V in our language, so it trips me up sometimes. <laughs> v vine wine. I'll just try and pronounce. Hey. Pronunciate my V's and W's. Thank you. All right, cool, cool. Lewis's wine, wine. Lewis's vine, wine. Let me just <laughs> wait. Let me just attract the gold first, and then. Yes, please do. <laughs> you guys are gonna spend like a hundred gold. It's gonna be the next session. It's like, oh, I have two hundred gold. Like what? <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> oh, sorry, guys. I am gonna take a swig of this and wander around town. <laughs> okay. 
uh, Maylor, you see uh, Frump, Frumple walk in, buy a bottle of wine, and go to leave. Do you want to say anything? Yeah, um, act of. Can I, can I get some of the wine, please? You hear before you reach the door. Did you say? <laughs> I have some of that wine. Oh, uh, sure. Here you go. Uh, do, do you want to share from where you're going? Like, I could accompany you. Yeah, yeah, like. yeah. Just come, I'm just having a walk around, having a look at the town, mm-hmm. you know. Sure, sure. Yeah. You want to swing? A gulp. We could, I swallow. We could, we could take gloves from the bottle and pass and go along. What? <laughs> what? what did you say? I said we could take gulps from the bottle as we go along. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You need a cool. you need a brown brown paper bag. <laughs> Do we? To, Do we? Yeah, to to appropriately. Mary. It, that's binge drinking etiquette 101. <laughs> We're not binge drinking. drinking. We're celebrating. <laughs> you both said that in unison. Just like, no, I am not ashamed of what I'm doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, as you turn the corner back towards that kind of that main street, um, you bump into Vale and Nilor, as they are on their way yeah. to the tavern. No, fuck you. I'm not sharing with you. <laughs> yeah, they're both hey taking guys, quite up? heavy okay. swigs. Okay, how's it going? It's all right. No thanks. Um, yeah. Where, where are you guys headed? Oh, you know, just around. Cool. I guess we I'm can go gonna... to Nilor's. What? We could go to Nilo's mom's. No, nah, I'm just heading to the tavern. Fair. I just came out of there. Oh, we, me too. Um, we didn't buy anything though. Okay. <laughs> they are holding a bottle of wine. I like <laughs> give a, like a side stare to the bottle that they're holding, and I'm like, okay, okay cool. sure. And then why? Didn't buy it. <laughs> <laughs> just wipe it. You want to come back to the tavern? Oh, fine. <laughs> Let's just go back. What a fucking. You don't have to. You guys can carry on. It's fine. Yeah, like you can. You can keep drinking. Shall we just go around look at, looking around the tower? Yeah, there's no one at the tavern. It's kind of boring up in there right now. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go and grab a couple drinks. Yeah, me too. Sorry. See you guys. Your mom's late. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. <clears throat> And that is where we're going to end tonight's session. Okay. Yay! That was good. <laughs> that was fun. I enjoyed today's session. You shine just being like, I want to fuck the elf. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's you not can't. Shine. It's Frumple. You're right. You're right. You're right. Frumple Stiltskin was like, I want to seduce the elf. But then, <laughs> and then you were like, Stop cheating on me, you're D&D. <laughs> and then you were like, then you were like, wait, th- he's not in the tavern? Like, he just lives there. <laughs> <laughs> you are an NPC in my game. You will do what I command. Wait a minute. <laughs> Whilst I was out the room, you were actually going to go and try and fuck someone. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, I don't necessarily. You are going to go and fuck Maximilius. <laughs> no, she's not. I wasn't. Frumple Stiltskin may have been. I don't know what she was up to. Frumple Stiltskin. Ah. <laughs> no. Oh, so Harry. Harry, do you want me to make you a love interest? No, it's okay. Okay, there's going to be some awkward tr- triangle, like love triangle going on. No, it's all right. I'm a he's done nothing to like win my affections. He's showed no interest in me. I don't know why he's acting like this. <laughs> wait, wait, are you still talking about game. are you still talking about his character or Yeah. 
I know it's a game. Oh, you didn't. You didn't understand the joke. It still makes me sad. Well, your character's not done anything to um, detail. Like me. The person playing the character has feelings too. <laughs> <laughs> this is the guy who was fucking random people on Cyberpunk. Yeah, but that wasn't me. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't me. I wasn't, no, 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 it wasn't my voice. It, it was first voice. person. <laughs> It was. It was doesn't do that. Oh my god. Yeah. Now nah, I don't do sex scenes, mate. Now nah, I got. If you want to fuck, okay, you fuck. Fade to black. Done. Yeah. Yeah. I it's ain't not gonna fucking. Be like... I ain't fucking role playing that shit. Fuck that. <laughs> or um, or do it. <laughs> also, I cannot believe you sold. You were gonna sell out Novi's character twice. Yeah, seriously. I mean, I mean, you did sell out Novi's character. Yeah, why did you do that, book? You're not even getting the money, so why would you do that? She didn't. I did. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking to Bonk. Yeah, she didn't. What? Sell out Novi's <laughs> character? Huh? Why would you do that? You didn't even get the money, and you just sold out Nori's character. I didn't sell it out. I just told the truth. I said that she was sighted five five seconds, five minutes ago, which means she's long gone by now. What? You know? Bro, when you said five minutes, he lost his mind. He was like, oh my god, she is so close. Exactly. If you'd have been like, exactly. oh yeah, she was here two days ago, he'd have been like, oh, okay, she could be anywhere. But five minutes, he was like... Well, we gotta go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You could have at least said, "Oh, she was sighted here two days ago," so you wouldn't have been like, "Oh, okay," you know. Nah, it's cool. But you sold her out. I wanted to give her a challenge. <laughs> so she's not even playing anymore. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta keep it alive. I or... was gonna. I was gonna keep it alive. I was going to explore her backstory, you know, write some Wait, stuff. Actually, no, you weren't. Yeah, fucking was. I, when she told me she wants to be a princess, I was like, fuck. And then I actually thought about it and started writing some stuff down. I was like, this is actually great. Oh, oh that's sad. You like can bring that, her whole, back some that whole thing about her being wanted, I was like, I'm going to have to do that to you, Novi. She was like, no, I don't want them to know. So I was like, fine. <laughs> fine maybe the knights are a little bit behind but at some point they're gonna know and then she didn't play so i was like well i'll just fry it in now yeah fair enough and then you tried to sell her out <laughs> bastards hey not me i, I wanted know. to help I her know. out I know. Okay? I know i know i know i know your conscience is clean don't worry yeah I feel bad for the wolf, but I don't know. We that's not on me. You don't have one more. <laughs> anyway, I I know I know exactly where I'm getting what D and D clip I'm taking from this, and that's Harry singing Wonderwall. <laughs> <laughs> but won't it be demonetized? <clears throat> no, it's no, a it's cover. Harry. But no, it's oh, right, okay. you're allowed to post covers and make money off of them. And plus, oh, it can okay. be parody because you were singing, you know, what, what an orc was it? The orc that was singing, yeah, yeah, yeah. When I as well you... as it was only the first two verses. When I <laughs> when I heard you go, I love this song, <laughs> and then <laughs> when you started singing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm letting all <laughs> I'm letting it all out now because I had to contain it because <laughs> you were singing yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god that was very professional for you Harry thank you that was epic I liked it <clears throat> well I'm glad guys oh yeah I'm gonna go and finally eat it's about time I do so everyone are we still streaming Say yes, everyone say bye to it. Bye Twitch. Bye Twitch. Bye Twitch. Bye bye. If someone bye, stayed bye. here for the throughout Crucify the whole day, the thank you so much. Bye. <laughs> bye.